But hello, hello, everybody. We are continuing our adventures through Digimon Cyber Sleuth. Last time, there was a big how to do about under zero and getting there through the Valhalla server. And lots of, uh, I guess, a decent amount of revelations. Mm, the bitch. As she will be known, because I forget her name. Kashibe? Is that her name? I forget. But she is like in league with a Digimon, or she is a Digimon, or there's a Digimon possessing her. Either way, evil Digimon that's in the way of us. Yuko was posing as Yugo, potentially against her will. Yugo's actual digital spirit is still around and can like draw off the eaters or scare them away. Omnimon exists and is working with Nokia to hopefully bring a better world. And I forget exactly where we were gonna go. Where are we gonna go? A message from Nokia. That is from Omnimon. Hmm, must be something important. My investigation is going to take a little longer. The sex and form, eh? Okay, good, good. Just wanted to triple check and actually use my hey. I can get information on where to go, and therefore I did. Our leader tends to keep his own company. In fact, I can get. Yeah, okay. You're just here now. Hey, you're back! See, Omniman, Neon's here! Neon, I apologize for the inconvenience, but we needed to talk face to face. Yes? Yeah, it's surprising, I know! He totally grew up! I mean, didn't we see it? We weren't really fighting at the time. I kind of miss Agumon and Gabumon, but look at how freaking cool he is! Yeah, so yeah, Omniman has to remember what he forgot. The reason why he came to this world. Oh, has remembered. Silence, fun! Okay, then, Omniman, go right ahead. Thank you, Nokia. Now then, heed my words. I came here to save the world we l Digimon live in, the digital world from destruction. The digital world is falling prey to the fury of the Eaters. All right, so the Eaters have been invading the digital world. I wonder what their origin is. There are Eaters on your world, too? Yes, the digital world is an optimal feeding ground for the eaters who consume data. Even as I speak. <laughs> Epic music for some reason! Omnimon is just getting heralded by a choir of angels. They are infesting our world, eating away at it. You know, this kind of reminds me of the Dee Reaper from Tamers. <laughs> you know, a, a thing that was like eating digital data and then was coming into the real world and eating real people. And was also evil and insane to a degree. I'm a member of the Royal Knights, one of the ultimate Digimon guardians of the digital world. We Royal Knights serve King Dr King Drasil. Yggdrasil, or Yggdrasil, however you want to say it. The, the fucking tree? King Drasil is the very order that exists to control the digital world. When King Drasil detected the Eaters, he monitored them, and soon after deemed them to be errors that constituted a threat. Following his commands, the Royal Knights began to search for where they came from in the hopes of completely annihilating them. We then determined the origin of the threat. It was in an adjacent world, in a certain cyberspace that had just been born in your own world. What? A cyberspace in our world? Do you mean... Yes. Eden. This network completely digitizes human consciousness to express it in cyberspace. In the first system, Eden's avatar's human mental data itself was what caused eaters to appear. Even more so than in your real world, human desire and spite, passion and rage were completely unchecked in the digital world you call Eden. Eaters were born from that unique set of emotional data. It can't be. Of course, there were royal knights who objected to such a hasty decision, myself included. However, there were many who agreed that this conclusion was correct, that the blame for all this lay with humanity. They now seek to destroy the human world. So, is the Digimon that's affecting the sexual harassment lady working to turn the eaters on humanity and away from the digital world to then destroy the human world and therefore the eaters. I could see it. 
When you say the human world, what are you talking about? Nakano? Japan? You can't mean... I do. Everything on this planet. Even if we were to eliminate the Eaters from our world, so long as their source, humanity, still exists, they will only reappear. Only by wiping out human, the human race can the Eaters be completely annihilated. At least that is the conclusion the others have reached. Digimon are planning on destroying all humans? They are aiming to invade. The Royal Knights lead a large force and are planning to surprise attack. Invade? But how? Digimon can't enter the real world. In the city you call Tokyo, Digimon are already appearing in your physical space, are they not? Fair. The digital shift. I mean the labyrinth phenomenon. What we call a dimensional wall separates the world of the humans from our digital world. However, by creating a large enough hole in this wall to serve as a sort of door, the two worlds can be joined, their properties intermingling. As a result, Digimon can pass back and forth between our worlds. The increasing strength of the digital wave phenomena in Tokyo is caused by ongoing attempts to open a massive portal into your world. That is the Paradise Lost Plan. So Kishibe, who is implementing the plan, is either acting in concert with the Royal Knights, or it is highly probable she is under mind control. So there are other Royal Knights here besides you? The two worlds are not completely separated. There are several small dimensional cracks in the wall. I was able to pass through by adopting the smaller data forms of Agumon and Gabumon. Losing a portion of my memories was an unforeseen complication. I would not be surprised if there were other Digimon who came through the same way. I see. I will do all I can to prevent the invasion of the human world. It is neither right nor justifiable to destroy another world in an attempt to save your own. I cannot abide such a destructive solution. Omnimon, you're right, and I feel the same way. Humans and Digimon ought to become better friends, not the other way around. There is something I, I need your help with, though. This is a riddle that even a royal knight such as myself cannot solve. Please help me uncover the truth of this situation, so that we may resolve it. <laughs> Garuru Greymon, indeed. He is the best boy. Especially because he is two boys in one. I'm sorry to have kept you waiting. Verification took longer than I expected. It took l it took the length of a conversation, Kyoko. Unless there is like obscene loading times in Eden, I think you're fine. But there's a reason for that. A number of interesting things have come to light. Return to the agency. We need to plan our counterattack ASAP. We're coming too. We have to tell her the news. I will say this is a twist I did not see coming. It's very interesting. And a part of me kind of wonders if it would have been cooler to have been playing as like Agumon and uh, Gabumon the entire time, working to attain our memories, uh, instead of this relatively bland protagonist who looks like just an alternate version of Nokia. <laughs> Sorry for the delay. Okay, Kyoko, let's start the strategy meeting. There's still one important person who isn't here yet. Arata is, wants to be... Ar Arata wants to be a loner. He wants to be the cool lone man. But is it worth the coffee? The coffee is worth torturing Arata, is what I will say. An important person? Who besides me? What? You can't possibly mean... Uh, I came because I heard there was going to be a strategy meeting to talk about how to get rid of Kashibe. But I see our wild one is here too. You don't want to talk, always making things more complicated just because you think you're some kind of legend, you emotionally stunted jerk face. You all, you've always been like this. You and up and disappear by yourself at under zero. You're no good at fighting as part of a team. Leave us alone. Sorry, but this strategy depends on all of you. I need our wild one and our legendary yet stunted, <laughs> legendary yet stunted boy to work together on this. I don't care. As long as we can beat Kashibe, let's get started. So says Arata. Any objections from our wild one? Hang on just a second. I want to tell everybody something. And then we tell what Omnimon said. The genocidal Digimon. Hmm, so that's the whole story behind the Paradise Lost plan. I see. I wonder how Digimon got classical literature to name their invasion off of. Destroy the human world. Seriously. I wasn't expecting it to be that serious. <laughs> now all my theories have been proven. Thank you, Wild One. Don't thank me. It's Omnimon who deserves all the thanks, and Kyoko, could you knock it off with the Wild One thing? 
<laughs> I think it's time to start the meeting for real now. We have fact A. Rie Kashibe's objective is to open a hole in the dimensional wall, a sort of dimensional door, if you will. Fact B. Rie Kashibe has abducted Yuko Kamishiro. These two facts cannot be unrelated. She must have needed B in order to carry out A. And A has still yet to be achieved. Our strategy must therefore allow us to both successfully rescue Yuko Kamishiro as well as to stop all aspects of the Paradise Lost plan. Aw, oh, my brain hurts already. And it's not that hard, Nokia. Do we need to get a Digimon implant in your brain? To get it to work better? We can't worry about the rationale for B right now. The plan's too bold as is. An excellent conjecture, true. But I have some new evidence I'd like to present. It should clear away your doubts. As vague as ever, you never change. Meanwhile, there's me. Basically the brute force of this company. Having run simulations on the labyrinth locations and the detectable digital wave flows, I've identified the existence of a large-scale, stable, and regularly occurring energy locus. Let me guess, the tunnels that we were in and went underneath government property and Kamishiro-owned place? It's a circular flow of energy that covers all of Tokyo. I've named the circular network the Digital Line. Surprisingly, this energy locus, which is comprised of digital waves, is under human control. In all probability, it is under the control of Kishibe at Kamishiro. I still want to know what Suido's deal is. Is he also controlled by a royal knight? He... But he created the Eden system. Because Suido created the system in which digital avatars of people could be created. So maybe he's an evil Digimon that opposes King Drasil. Maybe, or maybe he's just a psycho human, who knows. And, and then there's still the suicide of Yuko's father. Answers will be had, hopefully. And also the flashbacks of lost memories that the main cast keeps getting. So many questions in the final hour. In all probability, it is under the control of Kashibe at Kamishiro. The Eden spots placed throughout the city also seem to be related to this energy locus. I get it. The network in Shinjuku, where Neon Jump was part of it. R really? This is the secret behind the Eden spots. So they're pathways. Oh, I, I thought it was Kyoko I was talking to. So they're like pathways, sort of like lymph nodes. That's right. This network of lymph node-like structures resemble ley lines, conduits of supernatural energy known from antiquity. A digital version of an energy line. Kishibe must have spent a long time putting this digital line together. The structure that cycles the digital waves seems to be kind of energy reactor. The structure is truly well constructed. It stores, excites, amplifies, and releases energy. When the massive amount of energy stored in the digital line is released as a digital wave, I believe this door will open. Given how amplified I estimate this energy to be, I feel it's safe to say that the Paradise Lost plan could be brought into fruition at any time. Very not good. Furthermore, there's a place right now where the energy flow is changing drastically. Tracing that flow back, we arrive at Rapogni. I have no idea how to actually say that, I'm sorry. Beneath Rapogni is a Kamishiro research facility. It's called the Rapogni Underground Center. The RUC, I will say. Very dry, no? The name makes you think it's a government-related facility. You're the one that said it was! Isn't it? Didn't you? Yes, the underpass you investigated before. This is that certain facility that was back there. Upon analysis of your log data, the coordinates match where you left Yuko. That's got to be the nerve system where all of this is based. If we attack there, we get Yuko. That's one victory, but how do we stop Kashibe's plan? If B is needed to achieve A, then B occurs. If con condition C is needed to achieve A, then B will... Why you B in math? That wasn't even making sense! We don't even have a B! We don't have a B! I mean, C. We don't have a C. We have- they have B. We don't have C. Stop, stop, my brain totally can't take anymore! Just shut up, Arata, you geek! Geeky Arata, we'll call you Gita for short! Huh? What? <laughs> it's okay, Gita. We've got to interfere with her control of the digital waves itself. As I explained, the digital line is an artificial construct for controlling digital wave flow. That uh, control occurs via various terminals, including the Eden spots for its functions. In other words, if we could jam them. And that's it. You're talking about an analog method. In other words, knock out the power, right? Exactly. But they must be aware of their plan vulnerabilities and likely have backup power supplies already prepared. Therefore, we're going to need to strike in multiple places at once, or our whole plan comes apart. So we get a lot of people and turn the power off? You'd plunge all of Tokyo into a blackout. Leave this to me, Kyoko. 
Hang on, all Tokyo, but who? What do you mean? I'm a hacker, right? And hackers can only do one thing, right? Gather all my buds, and then we all hack into power supply systems throughout the city. All at once. How many more friends do you have? I thought most of them, if not all of them, got eaten by the eaters back in Valhalla. Under, under zero. We'll play nice, it'll take some time, but we'll be able to keep the range of effect to a bare minimum. I see. I've been thinking of asking you to hack into various hidden spots here and there. Assuming as we should that Kachibe is full of lies, we should strike at the weak points first. But he's extremely subtle, and even to the point of formlessness as the saying goes. Excellent, Sun Tzu! Be extremely mysterious, even to the point of soundlessness. Okay then, I don't get it, but I get it. It's like I don't get it, got it, but I got it. If Arata is doing that, then we're going for Yuko, right, Neon? <laughs> so good of you to grasp that so quickly. You should head to the Repugni Underground Center right now from the underpass. Neon knows the way, I believe. Then we start on our objective simultaneously. I'll leave Yuko to you guys. Okay, we're totally gonna rescue Yuko and put a stop to that parachute cord plan. <laughs> Happy movement, but confused because, friend. And I got four Digilines. Gekamon. All right, I got <laughs> that one correct. Gekamon, the farm is at max level. The beauty of the moon and stars here is incomparable to that of Japan. Look, I didn't even, you didn't even send a picture. Or, how's work? I guess maybe anything. Nope. Well, let's head off. Yeah, because I doubt there's going to be any cases on the case board. Then again, this is, might be the type of game to be like, Heh -heh, there's a side quest that can be happened at the right end. Wah -ha, ha ha Nope, no new quests. Just want to be uh, making sure of it. And we could level up Gekkomon and other Digimon. Hmm, actually. Might not be bad to check out and see if any of my main Digimon can be Digivolved up, maybe. But at the same time, I don't think Digivolution really would be a good idea this late into the game. Plus, yep, need to be level 50, 55, and 60. And not to mention the ABI requirements. I can't believe it. Nokia has a Digimon that is two Digivolution levels higher! I am enraged. Yeah, so none of them can properly digivolve. Profound sadness. Hopefully! They, and at least they're not going to be like far away from the level cap, so they're still going to be gaining lots of levels as they go. And I guess before we go properly, I'll also head over and give the metal dude some of the medals that we've earned, if we have any proper... Just, yeah, why not? We're going to our death. Hey, Metal Man. Here's some more medals. Okay, I gave you a lot of medals. Or at least a lot of very valuable ones. And then we can just leap through this way. Alright. Off we go to the Nakano. I don't understand why the Toyoso... Uh, Toyosu Condos is still a place. Why did you line? Leave this to me. You better handle your part too. <laughs> I'll leave it to you. And we'll save before we head in because paranoia, paranoia. Go to the underpass of doom. Wonder if this place got more digital. Is this your first time in a labyrinth? Oh, we're underground now. Who would have thought there'd be this big a tunnel down here? It's so humid here and the walls are so crawly. It's really undergroundy. Wait, crawly? Is there a tiny digital shift here? Yep, it's permanent. Where is Pete? Where is the Wanyaman with amnesia? It's been five billion years. Hmm, the effect of the digital wave is stronger than it was before. Digimon and eaters are likely to appear. Be ready for anything. Okay, won't do any, uh, want any good if we wear ourselves up before we save Yuko. Come on, Neon. Let's go walking to Ropogni. Wait a minute, are we supposed to get out, go on foot? 
Have you just noticed that Rapagni is about 10 kilometers away? Walking there will take about two hours. T 10 kilometers? Two hours? What do we do, physically speaking? I guess we'll just have to tough it out. Like, <laughs> left, right, left. Who? Who? Who are you? I don't recognize those shoes. Hopefully this will mean that... Hopefully this will mean that... Oh, Omnimon talk. Yeah. But yay, Omnimon is here to save the day. Ah, we can annihilate the, the worm, the sea monster. Annihilate is the proper term. And since we have two Digimon, let's just see. Probably should not have wasted my old, uh... Oh, that's... Mm -hmm. I'll have to give you some SP up. Ha! <laughs> Stun! Lol. The one time I get a stun, it's on a worthless enemy. Hilarious. And you leveled up, so I don't have to give you an SP up. Woots for you. Hmm. I wonder if that's because there was like a gate this way. And there still seems to be a gate, so we can't open it. And since the Digimon so far are rather weak, we're not going to activate our less encounters pack ability. Let's go ahead and get some experience a rolling. But yeah, it'll be nice to have Omnimon come along for the ride. And this also makes me want to do a run of this game where I use like all the DL, well, quote unquote DLC, the uh, Bibbidi Bop, the Royal Knight Digimon that came from the just buying the game. Because I didn't want to use them for my first run through, especially because I didn't have the I didn't have the like memory to have all of them in my party. Although that would have been interesting to like have specific like royal knights, and then you slowly get more and more to the party as time goes on. But I thought it'll be for like a new game plus playthrough. Oh, hey! We, I don't think we've run into you. What is his name? We'll annihilate you. Of course we get a combo. Hilarious. A combo with Omnimon. You're dead. The Supreme Cannon. Annihilation awaits. All right, not that annihilate but still. We'll just annihilate the snail Numamon. How dare you live. And then we'll just... Hmm. You scare me more. Oh no, not our defenses that will reset right after this fight. Be gone. Huzzah for the level ups. More and more digi lines. Ah, I don't care. You, you, you do not exist. You do not have a personality. As much as this game tries to impart it, you do not. Very interesting music. Okay, I was wondering why the camera was going wonk. Did I miss something? Are you all suddenly wearing rollerblades or something? Or have you broken into a dead run, panting breathlessly to get to Yoko's side? What? What are you going on about, Kyoko? We're walking normally. Maybe even slower than that. Why? Hmm, then why was I getting a signal from your Digivices in Akasaka after 20 or so minutes? Akasaka? No, even if we ran for dear life to rescue Yuko, we'd never get there that fast. Hmm, the labyrinth might be having a slight physical effect on you there, here. Eh? What? What do you mean? The distance of Rapagni has been shortened due to the digital shift. You can't tell, being underground, but the spatial distortion has contracted the distance, allowing you to reach Rapagni more quickly than expected. Really? Great! I only understood half of what you said, but I guess the digital shift is in our favor? I also just noticed something else. There's a signal from another Digivice behind you. It could be an enemy. Be on guard. Eh? On guard? Are we fencing now? Who, yeah, I was wondering who... Oh, Faye. Ah, what are you doing in a place like this? Y'all gonna rescue Yuko, right? 
Yuko or Yugo, which reminds me, you know that Yugo is Yuko all along? Sure enough, I knew. What was Yuko doing with a different avatar? Why'd she do that? That was the form of Yuko's brother. Her brother. Yes, he was. E he has Eden Syndrome. He's been out for years now, her older brother Yugo. Yugo used the avatar to protect the Eden that her father built in the guise of the Zaxxon hacker, Yugo. But wh why did she do that? Yuko's ties to her families were weak. family were weak. I think she craved a certain something to stay connected. Something for her family. Yuko, is that what she was after? Yuko helped me out when I needed it. She gave me a place where I could be myself. So please, let me come with y'all. I want to rescue Yuko. Let me help. Of course we'll let you come. You'll be a decent... Well, I, I trust her. I mean, I guess she wants the same thing we do to rescue Yuko. Okay, let's do this together. Together we can proudly rescue Yuko. Nokia. Thanks. Forget the thank yous. You're making me feel awkward. Let's just keep things the same as usual. <laughs> the same as usual. <laughs> you frumpy. Turn it down a notch, okay? Here we go. Lol. And now we have another ally. Are we just gonna get a, an army? Just marching towards Rapongni. Or however you say it. I'm going to assume this is the actual way. This is the first time we actually see that horrific monster chicken in the flesh. Hmm. Yeah, I'll just throw rocks at you. Probably shouldn't, because it'll probably actually be weaker, because it's water. Okay, never mind. Not terrible, but uh, not all that helpful. Let's Desolation Claw try to get this guy out. He'll probably live. Well, then again, we have the attack up, which is 10%. Huzzah! And now, Ostrich Ninja comes to beef up its agility. Atomic Blaster. How dare you try to get two attacks in. No, you die. Be gone, ninja. Alright, that's the actual way, Morton. Either way, it's a potential risk of wasting time to look down the other path. Because the other path, like, oh, we're going to put the treasure chest right up front. So it's going to be behind a gate when you go backwards. Alright, we're fighting two Digimon. Well, actually, no. Kyubimon wasn't on our team. But Renamon was. Chain Max. Oh boy. Let's try and annihilate the ostrich. Be gone, you ugly emu. And... Eh, we'll just... Let's not waste too much SP. Ah, uh, we didn't even get a combo. Annihilate him, Omnimon. Destroy him. Such a cool Digimon. Yeah, we'll go down this path to try and get more items. The game will probably taunt us and be like, ha ha ha, the item's on the other side of the cage, moron. And I will cross. Ah, I was partially right! I was partially right. It probably won't be like anything that I'll actually use because it'll be a consumable item. And I don't use consumable items all that much unless they're like heals or SP regeneration. But who knows? It could be a memory up or like a bibbidi bop. It could be anything. It could be a miracle meat. And now I'm... <laughs> And now I'm imagining Omnimon being distracted by big, juicy Digimeat. Like Metal Garurumon and War Greymon War. How dare you get in my way when the item was right there, but luckily we'll annihilate you in due time. Kick the ostrich. Damn it. It's always you. We'll deal with you with the others. Let's annihilate the turkey. 
And I think we'll be able to just... We'll definitely be able to just beat you up. Huzzah. Look how happy he is to have committed a murder. Wait, the uh, brain. How dare you confuse... We will annihilate you with extreme prejudice today. How dare you live. And as usual, annihilate the turkey. You have hurt me. Now you must die. Overkill only. Overkill only sounds like a type of game mode that would be in a video game where the everybody has absurd amounts of health. Okay, that was definitely worth it, yes. I mean, granted, Anjuamon does have the revival ability, but this allows me to not have to bring Anjuamon out if I want to revive someone. But huzzah. Tangible items that I want. Oh, hey! It's been a bit since we've ran into... I forget your name. Something... I... I always forget... The, like, his line's name. I don't know why. Well, how rude. Annihilate. Perfect timing to level up Cyberdramon right as he ran out of SP. And he, like, literally had the perfect amount to go down to zero SP. And just to be safe, we shall save. Also, I just noticed that Faye is not in battle helping us, which kind of diminishes her contribution, if you ask me. Ah, eh, we don't need to do that. We'll just annihilate you this way. Saint Knuckle, the wizard. Hmm. Let's see if I can just comet hammer you to death and save some SP. I can! Yay. At least every my other Digimon are also getting up there in levels, so if I really need to, I can hopefully be able to drag them into combat. Alright, let's go to the left this time. Actually, yeah, let's go to the left this time. Sneaksy Sneakersons will probably be like, aha, they'll never expect the same way twice. A critical double. That also seemed to do not that much damage. Why are you a big beefy boy? And you're only... I don't even... Ah, well, maybe we can just annihilate you. Goodbye, Numamon and Shell. Kaboom. And Woken Napalm him just to be safe. B critical! Now I wonder if there are games that have things like critical defenses. Somebody got Saint Knuckle and I missed. Because normally they don't get like abilities and skills all that often. But there is an item. So this is worth it. And I was right. They thought I they, they Bibbidi Bop Indramon medal. And for some reason it said A this time when through the rest of the game it has been X. Did are there settings in the game to try and distinguish between an Xbox and a PlayStation controller and that messed up? Cause that has clearly been an X through the previous bits of the game. I'm confused. This is my confused face. Okay. Annihilate. You're gonna give me a combo up? I'm gonna combo up this dude. How dare you live? 
Fucking napalm. A surprising amount of these are all dying to War Growlmon. And I don't know why. And uh, because my brain wants to see. Max 80, max 80, max 80. Good, good. They will probably be good for the rest of the game then. Because I do not see myself digivolving them. Because then their stats will go down for the end game. And I don't want that. And for a moment I thought that was a person. That's just a, hey, do you want to go to the lab? Let's see. Memory up. Okay, cool. Don't know why I need 105 mem- Well, okay, if all of them went to the next level and then the level beyond that, we probably need a lot more memory. Bye-bye, QB. Boom. Holy light. You know, Omnimon, you're kind of disappointing. Mega Kabuterimon. I need to read their names more. Woken Napalm. Destroy him. Ah, yes. More Ram Crunch. If the Digivice was a Digimon, I'd believe that. Destruction Cannon 3, you say? Besides, we all know that you just download more RAM. Ha ha ha. No, not organized settings. We can... Da, 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 attack break can be kind of nice. We don't use it. Anti uh, Gaia Element will be gone. Bye-bye, Gaia Element. I don't use you. And once again, our Digimon are not at the level... No, I always just saw it as you eating the memory items. <laughs> Ah, I need to level up my memory. Ah, a RAM stick. Nom, nom, nom. We need to force feed Nokia as much RAM as possible. You mean that we didn't want to bother with messing around with this The Dark Knight setup? Monitor setup when the first time we were here? Come on, Kyoko. You're a detective. You should have encouraged us to mess around in government secrets. This is Kamishiro's underground facility. Yuko's really in here so- they, She is right in front! In a machine! In the Lotus Eater machine, Nokia! Do you need RAM for your eyes? Ah! Oh. Why do you need to call? Well, uh, my Digimon just hang out behind me, and this is kind of a labyrinth. You should be here. There's a faint signal from the Royal Knights. This is it, without a doubt. Huh? Hey, over there! Her fi her eyes finally loaded. Sexual harassment woman! Which Digimon is possessing you? What she said. So you've come. Y you step away from Yuko right this instant! You're not going to get away with this! <laughs> I'm afraid I don't follow you. At last, the source of the calamity. Well, we can eliminate these filthy humans once and for all. We're here now, and there's no way you're getting away with that. We already know you're being manipulated by the Royal Knights. I don't care if it's what King Drasil wants or not. There's no way I'm letting you destroy humanity. <laughs> Omnimon's put you up to this. Omnimon, you're as much as a fool as these failures of human beings are. To support humans, and to turn your back on the nobler ideals. Ah yes, genocide, so noble. What? You... it can't be. Nokia, be careful. This woman, she is not human. What do you mean by that? That Kashime is... <laughs> well, we can just listen to her laugh. It's just laughter. There was no bwa ha I feel ripped off. Huh? What, what? There's something strange going on. Finally. Finally, this moment has come. None shall hinder me, as if they ever could. This is bad. She means to start the plan. It's too late. Open door of judgment. What are you, pyramid head? Arada, you really need to get the, the press on the gas. 
Press on the gas, noble man. Okay, the preparations are nearly complete. Now the others just need to rescue Yuko. Now we get to understand Yuko, uh, Suido's deal. <laughs> My, aren't we busy? Uh, you little rat! What are you doing here, Suido? Now, now, I just thought you might be busy. I came to lend a hand. What is your deal? Are you with the Royal Knights? Are you like some third party that's against King Drasul? Who are you? Because you saw us watching you when, uh, like watching you and Kashibe back when uh, Yuko stole the password so we could get into the secret room. What is your deal? Huh? Is this your idea of a joke? Sorry, but I don't have time to hang with you. So that's... So what's the plan, Arata, my pal? Are you... Are you the thing that came out of Under Zero? Because Arata said that. Arata said that something came out of Under Zero when he and his team hacked into Valhalla, hacked into Under Zero. Something came out and kicked their asses. Are you that thing, and that's why you're kind of obsessed with Arata? For the sake of argument, let's say for the cause for these distortions cropping up in our world was you and your friends. Huh? What? You distortions? Know. What the heck are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> but it's thanks to those distortions that this world is on the brink of evolving into something new. So he probably just, just cutting in because this guy fascinates me. This seems to imply that he wants to merge the digital world and the physical world permanently in totality. Interesting concept, my dude. Don't make me say it again. I don't have time for you and your jokes. You're Kashibe's errand boy, right? You just came to interfere with our plans. Nobody really understands what's truly going on, and I'm including Kashibe in that, too, by the way. Or should I say what used to be Kashibe? I'm simply searching for possibilities. That the world will embark on a better evolution. It is for the sake of that possibility that I've been watching you hackers all along. Your desire to tear down the vanity of the paradise called Eden. I felt the power of your future and the possibilities it might bring forth. So I nurtured it, let it blossom into something beautiful. That was the reason why I developed and gave you the Digimon Capture Program. You are the guy that started everything. You were Mr. Nav person at the beginning of the game. You! Okay. Okay, that that actually tracks. You're the one who created Digimon Capture. It was a side effect of our research. More importantly, though, a door is opening to a new world. The world I have wanted to lay my eyes on will soon be here. What? No! Now then, I must be going. Let us meet again when you are ready to open the door to new possibilities. Come talk to me. I still don't know what his deal is. I have no idea what his deal is. Hey, wait, you little... I have no idea what his deal is. We need to focus on putting a plan together. Otherwise, the others will... I have no idea what his deal is. The more is revealed, the weirder it gets. The door has opened. I've broken the laws of the physical universe. <laughs> She's kidding, right? I can feel it. The world is shifting to the digital. Farewell, wretched human scum. So, Kishibe is probably going to get annihilated here. Would be very weird to fight you with the, like, version that I can have. Is that a Digimon? That's Crusadermon, a royal knight like me. She was using Rikushibe's body as a vessel in order to act in secret this whole time. But what, Omnimon, you're in the real world now? The time has finally come. The door has joined the two worlds. It's been a long time, Omnimon, my fellow proud and gallant royal knight. It's too late for you, you know. You can still... Oh, it's not too late. You can still join us. Together we can destroy the humans and save our world. For starters, butcher those humans you're with. Omnimon, I shall not. 
Oh, you disobey King Drasil's commands to the very end. Is that the will of King Drasil to destroy humanity? I have long had my doubts. I have learned something by working with Nokia and her friends. Humans do not deserve to be destroyed. <laughs> You're a disgrace to the Royal Knights. Very well. I will put an end to you by and by. It will be an act of mercy. Welcome to the boss fight. Sweet, beautiful, sweet, or sweat. Well, let's see. Hmm. We'll need to go hard. Definitely need to go hard. Hilarious that Omnimon is strong against you. Desolation Claw! Be gone, you false crusader! I'll go ahead and guard break you. Especially because I get another attack. Spiral Masquerade. Lull. You hit the guy that doesn't matter in the end. Atomic Blaster. Get kicked in the face. Get chest blasted. Funny music in the background, but it kind of, it does fit the monologue that Omnimon gave us. Or the music that played. I vastly would have preferred if you just attacked Omnimon. Oh, you're gonna run? <laughs> it's too early to release my true power, but it's just a matter of time. You will run from this fight? I go to greet my comrades. I shall deal with you later. <laughs> Ooh, more anime. Yep, that's definitely a digital portal. And that's one hell of a Digimon. So, foolish humans, you will pay for your sins! Hello, moron. Wow, would you look at that. Your sins, probably. Either she didn't expect that Digimon, or his state. So, always nice that... <laughs> nice to know that Crusadermon's plan's a little fucked. What's going on? Or better yet, what are we going to do? <sighs> What's going on? A blackout? Wait, a blackout? Oh yeah, a rod in his butts were going to cut the power! Epic music. So is the... Oh, the portal's closing behind, so only a few got in. That's what she was worried about. Haha! -ha. I can't be. The dimensional door is closed. Uh, foolish humans. Such impudence. Only the second bit largest, bulkiest Digimon currently known. Oh. No wonder he was so huge. Still, even that brief connection to the digital world should leave enough of a lingering effect. Digital shifts must be occurring over a wide area. The proof is in how I'm able to retain this form. I can feel the power of the other royal knights. They are here somewhere. I shall search out the others, and together we shall destroy the human world. The plan may need slight adjustments, but there's no need to change the plan and to wipe out all humans. And you just keep on laughing like a maniac. So we're probably going to have to go on a hunt and kill the digital knights before she gets to them. No, it was too late. I'm sorry. That was completely my fault. Nothing to worry about. You closed the dimensional door. Omnimon said we avoided the worst. It's okay. We'll figure out something. Yeah, I sure hope so. I don't know why I bother trying to cheer him up. He's always the same old grump. What she said. Oh, that's right. Yuko. Uh 
Oh, that's not nice. That's not good at all. Oh, that's really not nice. Unless something happens. Yuko, did you become a Digimon? Well, that's quite fucked. Definitely, huh? Hey, remember that boss I told you about? Yeah, I see it. Definitely, what the fuck? You scum bucket! Get away from you, Ko! It's like, stabbed her all the way through. And it's a neutral! What fun. And it has a lot of health! Oh boy. Desolation Claw, let's go all in. Also kind of screwed up that it's basically using Yuko as a shield. Nightmare 3, I just got that. You're not special. Atomic Blaster. Her arms are cuffed to a blade, covering her eyes. Gagged her. Definitely. Definitely. Just mega weirdness, Japan. Definitely gets the freakiness through. And it's just like... It's a moment like this that goes, yeah! This is de a sign that Digimon decided to go, ah, eh, let's go a bit crazy. Let's go over the slightest bit fucked up. Memory divide, oh boy. And it's using Yuko as the blade. Luck, and it hits the one character who doesn't matter. Ha ha ha! You fool! You tool! You digital school! I don't think that really matters all that much in this fight, but the... The thoughts are appreciated, Faye. I'll just do another atomic blaster. This is thoughts. Do I? Because it does major damage. Jesus Christ, why? It's literally a ball gag. It is literally a ball gag. All right. Let's see. I should have an anti. Yeah, sleep recovery. I have lots of sleep recovery. Wear Gururumon first. We'll go ahead and get a kick in. Ah, uh, he'll be immobilized anyway. Desolation Claw. Get another sleep restoration. I will be annoyed if the game is like, ho ho, he did not become immobilized, but he's been asleep. So that technically is not the same thing. Lightweight. All right. Aha, it worked. Atomic blaster. A thousand, hell yeah. And uh, we'll just punch you. And we get a full combo, hilarious. Didn't kill him. But I wanted to kill him. It's no use. The thing won't come off. It's okay for us to take this thing down like this. Is it okay for us to take this thing down like this? What happened to Yuko if we do that? You don't think it would. 
No, no, we can't let that happen. Please, please save Yuko. Do I connect jump into the eater? Eaters are digital entities, which means, yep, I'm... What, what is it, Neon? I'm going into the hentai monster. You're not thinking connection jumping into an eater? I don't care, do whatever it takes, help her. And now you're, <gasps> are my Digimon the only ones that are not going to actually talk to me in a reasonable manner? It's going to be okay, Faye. I will go in your stead. What? I didn't issue no command like that? What kind of program acts on its own? It's okay, Faye. Trust your Digimon. It's like I said, Digimon are not just programs. T trust my Digimon. Well, this is freaky. And that's not even the shirt I'm wearing. How dare. I must pull Yuko out of the hentai monster. Am I going to run into... Path to the spirit world? That's not comforting. Why are you shaking your head? It's over. There's nothing else I can do. Everything I did, it was all for nothing. No one is coming back. I'm out of options. Your options are to live. So you better come back now. No matter what I do, if I end up with nothing, it doesn't matter anymore. Come on. Don't make me chase you to the ends of the eater. Yuko came down with Eden Syndrome eight years ago. Because my father was so busy developing Eden, I took his place at Yuko's bedside. No matter how many times I called to him, he wouldn't wake up. So I stopped trying. Harsh? My father died. It was Miss Ray who tried to cheer me up. And then Miss Ray got taken over by Crusadermon. So she wasn't always the sexual harassment officer. She taught me there was a way for me not to lose my family. Or maybe it was just a ruse the entire time. She said I should become Yugo and lead the hackers to protect Eden my father built. When I was all lost and alone, she gave me purpose. I wonder if that was actual Kishibe or not Kishibe. And so I, I abandoned myself and became Yugo. I thought I could lose myself and connect to my family at the same time. But it was all lies. I will chase you to the end of the eater. I suppose. I even brought my Digimon. It was all part of Miss Ray's scheme. All of the Zaxons, they weren't following me. I wasn't protecting Eden. It was all Miss Ray. I did nothing. I'm so lonely. I'm ridiculous and pathetic. Is this a metaphor for, like, d depression? Is this what this eater is for? Which then has odd implications for the BDSM symbology. Why won't you leave me alone? Because I am the mute protagonist friend. I can't go back anymore. I made too many mistakes. I failed, and as a result, Eden is still claiming more victims. What did I even think I was going to accomplish? You were hoping to accomplish good. My father, my brother, they've all left me. Father, maybe. Your brother was... Also, Yuko with a question mark. I just realized that. I didn't want to admit I was alone, but I've been alone for so long. So please, leave me be. I'm better off by myself. Is that the Digimon I gave to Faye? Yuko, you're most definitely not alone. Ever since you introduced me and Faye, we have had each other. You gave us a place where we could be ourselves. I stand with Faye, and Faye, she stands with you. Try to remember. So it must have always been at your side, even now. It is me, protagonist. Yes, Neon, I see. Yes, you're right. But did you jump out of here? I remember something my father told me when I was little and I was crying. He said, No one will be alone in Eden, your dad, in the Eden your daddy is creating. No matter how far apart their bodies might be, they will still be able to reach out ha a hand to each other. That's what Eden is for. 
a cyberspace unbound by the laws of the physical world. Faye and I are by your side, now and forever. I think I finally understand something Nokia said. Nian, thank you so much for bringing my friends to me, for reaching out a hand to me. I'm in I'm in through here. Please get me out of here. I want to be with you all again. Am I gonna have to fight the eater once more on my own? Inside? Or will be there or will there or will there be another twist? A toy train, how sweet. And horrifying. I am an angel! Here to save you! Okay, good. Happy music. I was afraid something bad was gonna happen. Be gone, Eater. And it gave her her leggings back! The miracle of the digital world! Please, open your eyes! <laughs> Faye? What she said. Faye, thank you for considering me your friend. Of course you're my friend. We'll always be friends, always. Oh, really? Friend? Is that good enough? Don't you really want more than that? You dumbass! What are y'all saying in front of you, go, you frumpy brat? Lol. What are you talking about? What were you imagining? Ooh, so naughty. Ooh, who y'all calling naughty, you dirty old fang? Yay, you made her laugh. Huzzah! What is that? I got eaten by a portal. This is disappeared. Well, no, no way. Why? Why all of a sudden like that? Where the hell did? Am I gonna go to the digital world now? Is that where I'm going? It feels like that's where I'm going. Child. This is either Arada or Yugo. This way, this way. That's Arada. Pink? I guess that's young. I'm going to assume Nokia. Let's hurry up and go. Really? I'm scared. Let's go home. <laughs> it's okay. Let's go. Child exclamation point question mark. Hurry, come this way. Faster, faster, but with a high-pass filter over it. Come this way. Come this. And there was a hand that grabbed. Digital world. It's the digital world. I didn't even think we'd get here. Digimon in the Forgotten Land. Chapter 12, Wandering. We're nowhere near the end, are we? We are nowhere near the end, are we? Have this, is this where you've been the entire time, Yugo? The digital world? Also, I feel like this is going to be the only amount of the digital world we see. Raven-haired boy. With the weird symbols we can't read. I wonder what it would be like to like know Japanese and hear the broken up fragments of speech and if you could like make out something. And you're an eater. Protect me, my Digimon! Or did I get eaten? All the eaters are here. This is how the world will end. As the number of eaters increases, the real world will be eroded away into nothing. You can't eat me, I'm the protagonist. Who are you? I'm Yugo. Yugo's brother. You don't have white hair, though. My body succumbed to Eden Syndrome and still sleeps. I am like you. No, I'm different. My body is completely cyber. Anyway, 
thank you for saving my sister from erosion. I also tried to save her, but had you not been there, she would have been devoured. Your means of doing so had never occurred to me. Your connection jump was quite the surprise, and it was because you connected with the Eater that we were able to meet like this. That's right, I called out to you. You responded and came here, yes? Technically, I was kidnapped. You just woke up here. You don't remember what happens. That is tragic. That may be in part because I called you. To respond to someone's call. You have that power, do you not? I suppose. I am a cyber sleuth. Aren't you curious where here is? The digital world! This is a special area found on a certain network. I hastily created it in order to meet with you. Oh. I just assumed it was the digital world, so now I'm sad. You subconsciously responded to my voice and accessed this network. Within you lies the fragment of me. It's a piece of my memories. That is how my voice reached you. I was so happy when I learned that you had it. But it might have caused you other problems. The strange things you've experienced here, they're all the effects of my memory fragment. You must have had similar experiences. They were the result of my memories drawing you in. I, too, have, have, have a few large fragments that make me reflect a lot on my physical body. This might have been troublesome for you. How so? You're the ghost of the pale, boy! I don't know what form my fragments take, but... I see. A ghost. That must be very unsettling. I bet it frightened Yuko and Nokia. Uh, someone's come for you. I'm surprised. How did they find us? She has a very deep, very strong connection with you. Who? Thank you for answering me. I'm glad we met. Who is the Digimon that came for me? Tell Yuko, Nokia, and Arada. I am... Okay. So... Look for me. I am confused. Ooh, a remix. They put keep out tape over the digital blot. Call. Whoa, I got through. Where the heck have you been? I got kidnapped. Neon, are you okay? Was there a problem of some sort? And even Harada? Hey, ask the questions one at a time. We haven't been able, we have we haven't been to make contact for over a week, and considering the way we parted, naturally we were worried. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. Anyway, it's great to see Neon still in one piece. An entire frickin' week. We can handle the details when we meet up in person. Is that okay? Okay then, let's meet up in Nakano. I bet Neon wants to get back to the agency. See you later, Neon. It seems I have every had everyone worried about me. Let's get back to the agency. In this entire labyrinthine world, the digital shifted world, Aw, uh, I would have liked if this place was digital shifted slightly. Ah, uh, Neon, welcome home. Thank goodness, I'm so glad you're okay. You're not injured, you're all right? Where were you and what were you doing? Like I said, ask the questions one at a time. It's no use, Harada. You should have seen Yuko when Neon disappeared. She was so, 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 so worried. D don't get the wrong idea. You vanished before I could say a proper thanks and I've slept badly all week, that's all. If you're going to disappear, let me say thanks for so we can end things properly. Isn't this hard to get act a bit beneath you? Anyway, thank you so much for what you did. We weren't the only ones who were worried. Kyoko kept looking for you the whole time, but she went off the radar a little while ago. I was wondering where she was. Would you like to tell Kyoko that you're safe and back with us? You should be able to reach her with your Digivice. No answer. Great. Don't tell me Kyoko is also, like, a royal Digimon. <laughs> You're not having any luck with her ears either. Kyoko, just where did you get off to? The government is rushing to respond to the mysterious phenomenon that is still blanketing the greater Tokyo area. We asked specialists about this strange phenomenon. 
which makes it seem like victims have become lost in some kind of virtual world and... Have you looked outside? The real world has been changing ever since. This is all they can talk about on the TV news. No nothing experts have theory after theory. A major digital... <laughs> Excuse me. A major digital shift has been occurring since the dimensional door opened, and it's showing no signs of resolving itself anytime soon. And Digimon are wandering free around Tokyo. I'm not worried about the Digimon. It's the Eaters who are attacking people indiscriminately. Ah, if only I could have stopped them faster. He already said we weren't going there, Arata. How can you be so casual about this? Eaters are attacking people as we speak. That may be true, but... And then there's Kashibe Crusadermon, right? She totally... She's still totally on the loose. That's right. We still haven't picked up on her trail. Hackers have abducted Ria Kashibe, the CEO of Kamishiro, or at least that's what the idiots in the media are speculating. Doesn't matter what it is, hackers are responsible for all the bad things that are happening. Everyone's happy to paint them as villains. It's no big surprise. Usually hackers are up to no good in their day-to-day -day activities. But this time the real harm came with the hackers failed. I thought we said... But what about your disappearance? What happened? Tell us about it. I met Yugo. He's a ghost. Still can't explain it. Surely it wasn't just all a dream or anything. Did, did you really meet my brother? He lies in Central Hospital unconscious and in a coma after succumbing to Eden Syndrome. And to think you talked to him. It wasn't like he was an avatar from Eden. He thanked you for helping me. My brother said that. I still want to know what that Digimon was that came for me. My brother. I want to rescue him. I will find a cure for Eden Syndrome. I will save countless... It will save the countless people who have suffered from Eden Syndrome and save the Eden my father built. To that end, I must find that person and finish things once and for all. Let's find Ria Kishibe. I mean, Crusadermon. She must be involved in my father's death, and I'm betting she knows more about the Eaters, too. I can't forgive Kishibe. She used the existence of hackers to her own personal gain. Royal Knights are high-level Digimon, right? Gotta find a way to fend them off in the Eaters, too. I'm worried about the Digimon. They're probably panicking due to all, all the sudden changes. They don't know what's going on and might lash out in fear. Left as things are, an actual war might break out between humans and Digimon. Omnimon says he wants to put a stop to that, and so the rebels are going to help Omnimon. In other words, it's time to execute the super love Digimon strategy to the max. It seems we've decided what we want. No, what we have to do. Ah, what now? What was that, Neon? Hey, Neon. Are you okay? I don't know. I think my digital body might be falling apart. Hey, you're half cyber body. There's a large scale digital shift taking place. It might be affecting your body, too. Hey, Mariyoshi. Oh, Detective! I should have figured you'd all be here. Kyoko isn't here. Can we help you with something? Well, I actually came to see. It's me, right? You figured that out quick. I thought you'd come for me sooner or later. It's about that hacking case, right? Yes, before long you, Arata Sonata, will be on the wanted list. Why? Well, why is that gonna happen? A warrant came down during the blackout, and then there was the disappearance of Kamishiro's CEO. Wait, sure he was hacking, but he just had but he had just cause. And as for Miss Rhea's disappearance, I know, but my superiors want Arata brought in for questioning as a person of interest. They've selected a scapegoat in the hopes of escaping public panic, easing public panic, right? That's how the big shots think. I'm sorry to say it, but you're right. I've heard the facts from Kyochan, though. I might not know as much as you kids, but I'm starting to get a handle on what's been going on throughout Tokyo lately. I will have a word with my boss. So Arata, your job is to stay here under police protection, okay? Not the worst. That sucks. Hey, run out on us and you'll be in, even, be in an even deeper. You're still a minor. Listen to me, I'm an adult. <laughs> hey, Arata, wouldn't it be better to do what the detective says for a change? Besides, the reason he was hacking in the first place was all part of a plan to rescue me. All of us are involved in these cases. We're all equally guilty. If you want to question Arata, then we should all share responsibility. Oh, hey, Yuko, this is getting a bit too messy. It's the truth. You shouldn't have to bear this all alone. Stop trying to be so tough. But then again, you are Yugo. You'll, 
You'll know what I'm about to say. I'm not trying to take a stand waiting for someone to cover for me. What happens when the cops finger all of us? That's some stuff I have to do, right? Let's pretend that outburst just now never happened. Detective Mariyoshi, you probably would have anyway. If Yuko and the others are guilty, then so are you. You got information from Kyoko, right? What? What are you talking about? Sorry, I was thinking about whether Date was up to anything. Date was up to anything illicit again. I was distracted and wasn't listening. Thanks. I'm sorry, but I can't go along with your suggestions. Me under the protection of a stodgy old adult like you? Yeah, that's not happening. You're not afraid to speak your mind, kid, still. You're not in any position to be tough, you know. That's not it. I don't think the police will understand my story. I guess I trust you, though. So, I'm a wanted national fugitive now. One more item off my bucket list. Excellent. But that means I won't be able to stay with all you all anymore. Arata? Hang on there, Sanada. Don't do anything foolish. <laughs> now who's the fool? When have you ever heard of a hacker backing down because someone told them to stop? Okay. <laughs> it sure is handy being able to summon up a Digimon at will. With this, I can get away, no problem. Oh yeah, that's right, Neon. You really are too soft-hearted. I'd get that fixed if I were you. All right then. It was pretty cool hanging out with you all. Ciao. Sanada, wait! Arata, why? What do we do? If Arata looks guilty, then the rest of us are free to move about as before. We need to hurry up and solve the case as soon as we can. Solve it and we can prove Arata's innocence. That's what he's trying to accomplish for us here. What? Really? If that's it, then he should just say so. What a pain. You're such a poser. Arata, you grandstanding buffoon. He certainly is grandstanding. It's like an affliction with him. But what he's taken on is a big risk. We won't let that be in vain. You're right. We have to do our jobs, too. I'll look for Miss Ray. I'll be in touch if I find anything. I'll work on the super love Digimon strategy to the max. Collecting info, friendship, and love for the Digimon. And now I'm alone. I am now the detective. What should I do next? I guess I'll be doing whatever I can. Very interesting. Things are escalating. Remember the words above the, the mantle. What? Gunshot or door? Date! Oh, it's just you? It's true then. That fishy sleuth woman really has disappeared. Are you gonna arrest me? Don't look at that me! You've got a bad attitude, I'll arrest you! And there's no use getting down over it. Just wait it out, that sleuth lady friend of yours will be back before you know it. Still, I didn't think you'd be the only one here. Well, uh, what am I gonna do? You have a case for the Kiramade Detective Agency? You're really annoying. That's better than being depressed. Guess I've got no choice but to go with you. I need that help anyway. I'll say there were exti extenuating circumstances. Can Ooh, is it Pete? Is it Wanyamon? Oh yeah, come on out. Who are you? Nope, it's a Lopmon. I'm Lopmon. Nice to meet you. All right. Is this the one? The one who will hear me out? Lopmon is your client. It's a missing person. I mean, missing Digimon case. All right. Chapter 13, that quickly. Tokyo Digification. How many chapters are there? That one was fast. Lol, adorable. Just hanging across the shoulder. Or I guess elbow. Big lol. And adorable. Um, so I've lost my friend, Tokemon. He's so small and now he's lost. Please help me look for Tokemon. I found Lopmon just wandering the streets. I couldn't just leave him out there. And then I thought about you guys. You're good at this sort of weird cases, right? There are cases like this all over Tokyo now. It's pandemonium out there. Even us police officers aren't sure what to do. But then I came across this little fella. I can understand him. He's not violent, and he's so, he's so, he's so darn darn cute. Hey, did you just laugh at me? Sorry for a bricky character like that. Anyway, it's not like me to just take it out on them because they're Digimon. He's harmless and in trouble, so I let him tag along with me. 
Excuse me, but there are lots of kinds of Digimon. Calm ones, wild ones. Never mind that. The same is true for humans, after all. But let me touch your ears later. <laughs> Lol. How'd they get so fluffy? I bet they're so soft. <gasps> anyway, I've got to go help uh, uh, out at Mariochi's place. I'm leaving Lopmon with you. Keep an eye on him. I've got that. Hilarious. A client is a client with a human or Digimon, no matter what. Kyoko! Oh. <laughs> the flashback. I didn't even think we need a flashback to reassure ourselves. Thank you. The rest is up to you. Make him cry and I'll never forgive you. Oh yeah, Mariyoshi told me to tell you something. Your friend Arata, I think his name was, a warrant has been issued for his arrest. Figured that. Well, he's now on the National Wanted list. Some top brass idiots think that Arata was the key figure behind all this weirdness. Don't get me wrong, Mariyoshi went above and beyond to try and clear things up. But it was in one ear and out the other. When Arata ran, he looked even more suspicious. Hey, don't worry, Mariyoshi is on it. It'll all work out in the end. I was a brat at sometimes too when I was a kid. Just look after this fe that fellow for me, okay? There was a reason behind that what you did, right? Then don't fret. Mariyoshi doesn't give up on people just like that. See you later. Look after the little guy for me. Your friend is lost too. Yep. We'll look together then. We'll find them, I'm sure. Okay, now that that's decided, let's go friend searching. Oh, hey, Pete! Hey, I was able to come to the real world, too! I know it's because bad stuff is happening, but it's so nice to be here with Kyoko and everyone. Ah, uh, yes! Kyoko, who is not here. How about bringing a little something next time? Sure. I really doubt I can get stronger just training. Maybe if I did more reps. Lol. Arad and Koko... Okay, lots. <laughs> Damn it, Arad, don't go off on your own. I'll give him an earful when we find him. Arad and Kyoko are concerned, yet don't be dismayed. I'm sure we'll... I'll see what I can find. Gotta take a break now and then. For me, a quick ice cream break does the trick. Th <laughs> Thank you. Maybe I'd try some. I do have ice cream. Maybe I should have some. Seems like things are getting crazy out there. You watch yourself in the city. Got it. You be careful, too. Alright, is there any cases? Nope, no new cases. It's all, all just all out there. I wonder where Kyoko went. It's a little lonely, but since she's gone, I'll help you instead. Well... I wonder if they'll just be... I guess we should probably talk to people now that things are crazy. I never see Mirei from the consultation room around anymore. Not that she was around that much to begin with. Ah, I want to consult with her. Consult on what, Digimon? Anything new? Nope. May Is nobody going to comment about the new things? Any new items? Multi-recovery and revival capsules. You can just buy revival capsules now. Huzzah. But I should probably sell some of the, like, uh, aquamarines, the pearls that I have. I have a lot of fucking money. But we should probably just look around this place to be safe. I went outside and saw a monster so scary I ran right back in here. I don't ever want to go out again. Hey, I don't have anything to do with this Digimon craziness. Sure, I'm a hacker, but this is too much. The other day, the supermarket nearby was hit by a hacker. I heard they took every yen. This is really the end times. Yes, yes, yes. Digiline, Digiline. Trivia. What attribute of Digimon do wind Digimon damage the most? Not dark. Wind, because... I think wind damage... Earth? Yeah, Earth. Because electric is damaged by Earth. So wind would damage Earth. Recently, my friends really got into Jimmykin. Jimmykin has been annihilated for like a month now. Wait, if we're just going to walk around, see if there's anything new. Nope, oh, just that same juke. So as long as I have mangas, I can survive anything. No matter what happens, I'm not scared. Hilarious. I bought it. The 200,000 yen figure. Now I'll take her home and look my fill. Huh? Something going on outside? Has he just been here this entire time? What do you say? Do you see the hacker Arata Sonata who was put on the National Wanted List? He's kind of hot. Lol. I 
A metal maniac is someone who really likes them, right? I gave him some rare metals the other day, and he paid me a whole lot for them. I should probably sell some as well. That aroma. <laughs> nope. Still can't go in and do it. Oh, let's take a look. Myself. Anything wacky in here? Uh, Kyoko. Right. Welcome. What? No, no matter how wacky things become outside, we're open and happy to serve. How about a cup of our special blend? As long as it's not Kyoko's special blend, we everything should be fine. I have... Uh, I, okay, good. There we go. Whenever you want to look at a lot of metals, go to the Metal Maniac. Hmm, the guy that's always stood out here is gone. The Arata Sonata has been seen around here. Me and my punching game trainer will take him down. It really won't. I can't get enough of how mixed up Broadway is. To me, it's the ultimate multi-tenant building. It's kind of cool having a detective as a buddy. You know, as doom and damnation spiral from the sky. The world outside is frightening. Meanwhile, Ryota, it's neat having a detective as a friend. Let's go to the hospital. Oh, are you here to visit? Nope, nothing seems to have changed here. Yep, nothing changed here. Probably because they didn't expect you to come back. And nobody comments on Lopmon. Well, let's go about Shinjuku. Oh, hey. Attention all citizens! Please return to your homes and remain inside until the crisis has been resolved. Uh, what in the world is going on here, and how in the world do we stop it? What's wrong with the pretty lady? She looks really, really sad. And Mariyoshi. Watch yourself! Don't do anything to provoke them! You've got to be kidding me. Like those idiot hackers haven't caused enough trouble. Why does this always happen when I have a date? Lol. People are just hanging out. Not that many cars. Alright, I wish I could go in and stop that. I just want to go home. Freeze! Not another step! Arms in the air! You're under arrest for, um, for, for crimes and stuff! The human world sure is busy. Really busy. I think I should find somewhere quiet and just take a breath. Yeah, that's a good idea. I mean, they're just standing there. Wish I could go talk to them. I am a digital expert. Like, you know... It would be, it would be kind of cool if this was like the beginning of the game in a way. Or like the halfway point or something. If you keep heading this way, you should... <laughs> oh, wait. No, he actually changed. But maybe you should head home instead. Lol. Wow, these, high <laughs> these highfalutin city events sure tear up Jake, don't they? What kind of what kind of to-do you think all this is for? Maybe they're making one of them video games. Uh, you ain't got the sense God gave to a billy goat. There's no ordinary ruckus. <laughs> this is no ordinary ruckus. Oh, hey. Hey, is she doing all right? She looks pretty tired. No, that's a... Staccato man? Hey, is she doing all right? She looks pretty tired. Eaten, eaten in the street by a Digimon. I didn't see the end coming. Goodbye, sweet world. The hacker has nothing to say. The Numamon is just dancing. No freaking way. Is that monster that was all over the news and stuff? It's totes adorable. It's um quite adorable, but not have as radiant as you. Uh, yeah, duh. Not this time or not at this time or place. You for real? Is this your idea of a romantic moment? Well, well, you better keep saying then, over and over forever. I love you. Right? Sorry. Look, just I love you. I've always loved you. Cowardly businessman. A human just bumped into my bag. Oh, I'm done with talking to them. Lol. The monsters that have appeared are not quite what they seem. Their hacking programs give them physical form. They call themselves Digimon. And as they are hacking programs, the natural route would be to trace the cause back to the hackers. There are plenty of rabble-rousers trying to start some sort of hacking witch hunt. They think it will stop the madness. Is that a reliable hypothesis? Is it the truth? Who can tell? However, I personally fear that this is a harbinger of something far, far more dangerous. Now that there are Digimon hanging about, I actually, like, really want to talk to everybody. Monsters are roaming the streets and causing chaos. Even normal citizens are falling behind to loot. Tough day. Hey, Anjuman. So this is the human world, huh? Intriguing. Perhaps there was time to see some of the more famous sights. 
hilarious. Digimon want to be tourists. The stairs lead to the Shinjuku underground, but I'm sure it wouldn't go down them. It's dangerous. I like living too much. The time is upon us, husband. Thou must release me from these bonds that I may return to the home and land of my birth. Wh what? This land, fallen under a grave curse, is venom to all that remain. I fear that my sires may worry themselves into an early grave. Why are you talking like that? Nobody talks like that. I think she's gone insane. I wonder if it's a reference I don't get. But yeah, it's kind of just funny that Digimon are just hanging about. Uh, I can't actually go down there. It would be interesting. They'd be like, I can settle the Digimon. And nobody questions the, the teenager walking around with Digimon. Well, that's an interesting sight. Is that a Digimon? Like, for real a Digimon? I thought they only appeared at the lower levels of Eden. Look at all the stripiness. Stripey, stripey, stripey. Big Digimon are hard to catch, but that's just a given. But the little ones are surprisingly agile. Why are you lo Oh. <laughs> hey, hey, I told you not to just go around destroying buildings all willy-nilly and junk, but will you listen to me for once? This thing is weird. What is it? <gasps> what is this? <gasps> what is that? <gasps> How is everything so interesting? Sunamon is uh, going insane, I think. All the Digimon over here are always chatting everyone up. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> it's kind of cute. Look at the Digimon. It's so cute. Oh, Nokia's here. Stick with mommy, sweetie. I won't let those wicked monsters take you away from me. The human world is definitely a wonder. It's so loud, busy, and crazy. I'm only visiting, and I'm already stressed out. Come on. It's not that big of a deal that we can talk, right? Is it? Come on out, Sonata. I know these monsters are all you're doing. Send these Digimon back where they came from, you coward. Shut up. What if his friends come after you? He's a weird little man. Mm -hmm. What? I see. So you're searching for her friend? Excellent, Neon. Good job. You're a great rebels prof professor, I guess. But where's the profit in that, right? Never mind. I'll help look. The rebels' motto is no Digimon, no life. Oh, and also to the digital world. I can't leave these cute Digimon alone. I'll gather info in the real world. You should look into that friend in Eden. Okay. <laughs> she actually said okay. Find out all you can. I'm going to go see if... I'll leave this to Nokia and head to Eden. No. No. Okay, good. Because I want to check out the record store. I want to see more of the world first. Seems like things have gone pretty nuts, but you're okay, right? We're fine here. Little Kyoko isn't back yet. I'm no Kyoko, but I'll help out however I can. Thanks. Don't kill Sonata. Hey, the news says crazy things are going down in Tokyo. I'm fine. Don't worry. I'm not going to tell my mom to take a chill pill. But yeah, I'm going to see if Edamon just has appeared in the store. That would be hilarious. I just want to go home. <gasps> I can't go home. Monster's just waiting waiting to attack. Besides, if I get in a fight my suit, suit gets torn, my girl will kill me. <laughs> I'm starved. Is there any food? All those monsters are called Digimon. But of course you already knew that, didn't you? Just a friendly reminder. If you make eye contact, well, that'll set them off. I don't know about you, but I have learned my lesson. Wow, this is one of the legendary CD stores. Wow, it's so beautiful. Hey, what's a CD? What happened to my Shibuya? Just yesterday, everything was so perfect. Shibuya, girl. Is Edamon here? Ah, uh, Edamon's not here. When the Digimon started appearing in the real world, I was startled at first, but it meant I could speak directly with Edamon and music-loving Digimon could come to the shop. A world that isn't so bad. I listened to this album on a whim and really liked it ever since, okay? I guess nobody else here has changed their lines, which is sad. It would have been amusing if Edamon was just there. Now I can <laughs> tell people to buy my stuff myself. There's a monster. There's monster spawns all over Akihabara. I wonder what kind of loot we get. Get out of them. Wait, are they real? What do you think this is, Yu-Gi-Oh? 
It's just like an RPG. All of Tokyo is filled with monsters and soldiers. It's awesome. Wait, my anime figurine collection could be in trouble. And my hug pillows. I hope my doorman held the line against those beasts. I don't think this many nerds would be insane. Will you please get to safety? I can't be the first officer to tell you this. But I have Digimon. Whoa! Someone save me, Desu! I have no kaikaku for this situation! Bankai! Tatabayo! Kamehameha! Uh, Bleach, Naruto, and Goku will not save you, my friend. Oh, hey, it's Gazimon. Hey, do you want to have some human realm money? I totally want to go oh, browse around the arcade. Oh, hey, it's a Biomon. Wow, those humans kind of look like Nyaramon. Do you think they're just really intense fans? Lol. The skies open in a dark monster descend upon the earth. This is my chance to finally be an anime hero. You are going to die. Maybe some glasses clad, black haired, skimply armored, busty beauty will descend next. That has to be a reference to another anime that I'm not getting. We'll share a special bond that none else could hope to replicate. I'll teach her about our world and emotion and she'll fall madly in love with me. With your luck, it would probably be a royal knight and they'd murder you. All the other shops in the area are closed like sane, reasonable people, but our crazy boss says we, we just cornered the market. Uh, well, I guess my five-minute break is over. Back to the salt mines. Teehee. Hi there. Come back to the cute maid cafe. Would be hilarious if Digimon went to the maid cafe. Oh, hello. This hard stuff you guys are walking on is just everywhere. Isn't there a place with some nice soft dirt I could pl plant down in? I know I need to go to... But I, I just want to hang out. Oh, hey, what the hell? A Mamamon. Don't poke me at that stick. I'm telling you right now, that won't end well if you poke me with that stick. I think he's asking for it. That Aratus and Aratus to blame for all of this, I tell you. I'll never understand why the cops just let criminal hooligans look like that run free. <sighs> What's taking that loser so long? The world's going crazy, lady. No way, no way, no way. Asakusa is supposed to be calm and serene and peaceful and we gotta run. Go, get out of here. I just want to go home. How do I even start to get home? Oh, hey, it's the victory dude. It's a day for victory, if a strange one. Things are looking pretty dire here in Tokyo. But it's times like this that spirit's more important than ever. So take this. Aegis apple. What's an Aegis apple? There's no reason to fear. Men die when they are meant to. Okay. You are a scary little man. But what the hell is an Aegis apple? Is it an equipment? Is it a farm good? A key item? I still have the boxing association card. So is it a usable? Aegis Apple. Oh yeah, I forgot that I had you. We never did feet to increase defense. Oh, it's not that cool. We never did use the Digi Egg of Courage. I had an ex-Vmon. I should have just de digivolved him back to Vmon and then make him. Yeah, just everyone responding. Let's go to Tosu. We can come here. Why not? And nothing has changed. My Digimon aren't even here. Probably because it's a small area, but still. And uh, probably don't want to go there. So we will head back to Nakano and we will head into Eden. Uh, nope, and everybody in Nakano is just, yeah, taking this chill. Nope, nothing. Oh, I guess we can go digivolve some of the farm Digimon. Alright, let's go to the farm. No. No. Well, I guess we... Max HP. Mega Seedramon. And so we'll leave you. Genryomon. Let's see. No. 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 Aquilamon. No. No. Abomination. We can't even be rid of the Abomination. Cubimon, can you? Nope. Garurumon? Nope. Impmon? Impmon can be Digivolved. Oddly cannot become Black Godamon. 
I guess let's go ahead and make a... I'm going to assume a wizard mon. Neat. What can you turn into? You have more options than sorcery mon, it seems. Let's see, Paladramon, 87, so I'm going to assume you're one. Yep, and we you don't even have the ABI to evolve. I forgot how cool you look. Anjumon, can you did you evolve? Not yet. Let's be gone with the poop man. Wow, you suck so much you can't even did you evolve into any of the anything else. Become an Agumon. It's better. Don't know why an Agumon can become that, but sure. Alright. Nope. Gardromon. Nope. Geckomon. Geckomon can digivolve. No, he cannot because he is a worthless little bitch. Go become a Betamon. Shoutmon can digivolve into his... No, he cannot because he is a worthless little bitch. Why would you even want a... Why would you even want him? Well, it's kind of funny that we can have a mini Omnimon. That they cannot digivolve in any shape, way, or form. Again, probably not a smart idea to digivolve anyone, even if they could, but at the same time, I'm curious. Ever so slightly curious, but nobody can digivolve. Well, off we go, and we shall head to Eden to search for your friend. Come along with me, wee! I guess let's go to the Eden entrance. Well, what am I supposed to do now? Mr. Navit, you've got to tell me! What is your wisdom, Mr. Navit? Hi, hi, I'm Mr. Navit. I'm Eden's cute and clever mascot. Such wisdom. Hello, Digimon. Whoa, everybody's surprised and running away! So cool! I'm gonna chase him! Of course you would. Oh, hey, it's a Vimon. How you doing, Vimon? This world's so big. If a Digimon gets lost, you might never see him again. It's scary. Tokemon? Where'd you go? Hmm, so you're also looking for a Tokemon. I can't believe my friend's late again. She told me she refreshed her house's access point, so I thought she might finally be on time. Forget the tech. This is a personal flaw. Knowing my luck, Tokemon has probably gone straight into Kowloon because the Digimon do not seem that bright. Which tracks for the majority of Digimon media. Digimon arguing? Cough up the dough, pups, unless you want to be busted up by my Digimon. The hell are you looking at, punk? You're a hacker. I don't have anything. Why can't I intervene and punch him up? Are monsters really appearing in Tokyo? I live in Kansai, so I can't see for myself. But if it's true, that sounds so cool, like an RPG. You can beat them, get experience, and level up, right? Hee <laughs> hee. I mean, he's technically not wrong. Hey, it's a Tantomon. Tokomon was someplace filled with boxes. What was the name? Fury Area? Free Area? Thank you, Tentamon. You have answered the call. It's very interesting to see Digimon hanging out, though. So to the free area. Hey, Yuko. Lol. Why are you being a hat? Um, he seems to have taken a liking to me. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. A Digimon uh, assessing Yuko. Squee. Hey, it's Tokemon! Adorable Tokemon. Tokemon, thank goodness we were looking for you. I'm sorry I had you so worried. I see, you came here looking for this little guy. 
While I was making my rounds in Eden, he was here the whole time, shaking in the corner, the poor thing. Oh, making my rounds? I was checking up on Eden, actually. Kamashiro is short-staffed right now, so I figured if there was anything I could do to help. And actually, I'm also trying to bring the truth about Miss Ray to the light as well. Once everyone knows the real criminal is Rea, Kishibe, no, Crusadermon, then Arata will be cleared of any suspicion. This is an adorable... Adorable little side mission. I like hanging out with the Digimon. Why couldn't my Digimon be more like... Lopmon and actually hang out with me and talk. Once, yep, then we'll be cleared. To do that, I'm bringing back the ex uh, execs that Miss Rhea kicked out of the company. With their help, I'll release all the information Rhea was keeping secret to the public so that we can rebuild a new Eden. The fact Eden is being restored so quickly is thanks to them. They may be few in number, but they excel in what they do. The appearance of Digimon has Tokyo in an uproar. That is why the Eden Network, the key to disseminate information, must be strong. And Faye is helping me as well. She should be guarding Eden while I'm chasing down Miss Ray. Thank you, Detective Neon. Thank you, nice lady. Adorable Tokemon. The Eden my father built took away so much, but the true Eden should not be like that. Bringing together humans uh, with... Humans with humans! Digimon with humans and humans with Digimon. The way it was, like, the sentence flowed felt odd like humans with humans i thought that was a like an error in grammar no it was, it was a theme the new eden will be that kind of place you'll see let me know if there are any new developments i'll help out where i can kyoko it was no good neon there were no witnesses in shibuya what's next what? You found him already? That's great! I, I mean, hey, great work. You know your stuff. Now that's a true detective, a real professional, or is this like Project Z? I don't know what a Project Z is. Okay, let's meet up at the agency. Lol. They're just dancing, dancing, in happiness. I'm so glad you found him. You say he was at Yuko's place. Thank you for helping me find him. Adorable Yo Tokomon. You can't count on- you can count on us. The rebels are friends to last Digimon. And do you two have a proper place to live? Can you return to your world? We fell from the gigantic hole that opened in the sky a little while ago. It was a week ago! We lost each other while running from the eaters who fell from the sky with us. I see. Well then, why don't you come to my place? You have place? Together with Omnimon, we're creating a haven for Digimon with nowhere to go. The more the merrier. Omnimon, the Royal Knights? Wow, we get to meet him? But of course, come with me, I'll introduce you. Leave these two to me, Neon. You need to be a good detective while Kyoko is gone. If the reputation of the agency suffers while Kyoko is away, there'll be a warm spot in hell just for you. You, you are a real friend. Real friend, Nokia. It's as you say. I've got to handle the cases while Kyoko goes away. I don't think I could handle hell besides. So is this... Is this just like the halfway point? It feels kind of like the halfway point. Just because kyoko has gone doesn't mean the agency shuts down. wonder if there are any new cases. Which is the only holiday in October. I don't know. Labor Thanksgiving Day? I don't know Japanese holidays. Maybe it's Nokia's birthday. I'm gonna go with Thanksgiving. Free! Escape from unemployment. Find the missing. And then a purple, a villainous cinematic case. Lol. Escape from unemployment, sleuth secret, and Thundermon medal. I want to be like a human, get a job, and earn some money, but I can't find a job. Help me f- A Piedmon? Are we going to tell him to go be a clown? I have to see this. I have to. I have to see this. I have to see a clown looking for a job. I have to. Does this mean that we get to go to Kowloon level 5? That is something that I should have realized meant that this wasn't the end of the game.
what? There's there's a chest up here. How did I never know there was a chest up here? I got export that I never use. I should probably use them more. Especially because you can just buy them, I'm fairly certain. Listen, you two are just going to get annihilated. Go home. Literally annihilated. Literally annihilated. Goodbye. Why are the Digimon still trying to fight me? Don't they realize that I'm God to them? Also, there's nobody here, which is disturbing. I partially wonder if this Piedmon is luring me into a trap! You can never know with the Sneaksy... Sneaksy Digimon, but there is a Piedmon up there. Up we go. So, you want a job, eh? Hey, I was waiting for you. I need your help finding a job. Take it easy every day. Taking it easy every day is fun and all, but I can't keep this up. I finally realized if I want to be just like a human, I need to get a job. Hub, oh, can't... That's going to be tricky. You know, coexisting between coexistence between Digimon and humans is really tough. Anyway, back to what I was saying. With this look and this face, both adults and kids are scared of me, and neither will come near me. Even for work that isn't as public, I've been told looking like that will distract the other workers, and I get rejected. No one will employ someone like me. Please, I'm desperate. Could you find me a job somewhere in Eden? Aren't there various spaces in Eden where people gossip all the time? Maybe you could find some info on a job in a place like that. Hilarious. He's sincere about it. Go to find work in Eden. A gossip place. So one of the forums. And I'll just walk. The Digimon aren't strong. I can just walk on out of here. But it's just hilarious. During all of this, a, a Piedmon just wants a job. He wants to earn human money. Go become a horror attraction. A digital haunted house. A haunted server. Alright. We will try the forums. Let's go Zaxxon, see if there's anything. Oh, hey, there's Faye. Ms. Yuko told us that you've been rather busy as of late. And that's it. Well, yes, I have been. Let's go to the demons. There's just one guy hanging out here. What's your deal? I was a demon hacker until a little while ago. Heard they broke up, though. It's weird. You'd think a few would still be around. Alright, so none there. Let's see. Maybe the open space? Hey, you! Yeah, you there! Sorry to come out of the blue like this, but do you have any special talents? You look like someone of pride in their skills anyway. I have a few Digimon. You can use Digimon? Then you're a hacker? Well, this time I'm just looking for anyone who seems agile, so anyone will do. Sorry, I should have said Assyria. I'm a circus ringleader. Although our circus is very small and totally unknown. But our dream is to do our nationwide public event. So we uh, go around Eden putting on big public shows. The group members are really into it, but all of them are surprisingly bad performers. I'm looking for someone who can coach the other group members and encourage them, but... Huh? You know, just a person? A Digimon with good motor skills and ability to juggle and who is a qualified clown? <laughs> So this Digimon, he doesn't attack people, does he? Okay, we won't attack him either then. We are a circus group operating in Eden, so we, I suppose Dig Digimon could work here just as well as the other members of the group. All right, let's do it. Could you please tell him to come here then? We can have an interview in person. 
Please tell the Digimon to be himself and show me his individuality. Hilarious. He literally is going to go become a clown. Clown Digimon, become clown. I don't know a health and sports day. There is no health and sports day in America. If there was, really, there's only sports days in America. There's no real health days. Because employers don't want their employees to have days off. And the health situation in America is absolute shit. So really, there is nothing about a health day in America. At all. Go become clown, clown. Huh? You found a job that would suit me? What kind of job is it? An unknown circus group member. They're looking for a talented person who can train them up? That's it! That's perfect for me! I probably won't make much of a salary at first, but even though it's an unknown circus now, I'm going to make sure that someday it's big. Thank you for finding me a job worth doing. I'm going to go there right now and show them how to perform. I'm glad I hired you. I'll send your payment to your office. I'm still kind of scared. Please, before I meet the circus regulator, could you give me some advice on human interviews? If you help me out, I'll make it worth your while. I just, when I start to think about the interview, I get so, so nervous. Please, you gotta help. You gotta, you're getting too worked up about it. Just try to relax a bit. Well, what can you do except practice? Mm. Don't worry, you can do it, no problem. Really? Do you think that even a Digimon like me could get a job if I try my best to make myself an attractive prospect? Yeah, you know that. You're right. I feel a bit more confident now. Thanks for that. In that case, I know it's a bit sudden, but can you teach me how to pass an interview? Firstly, in, at the interview, when I greet them, introduce myself. What should I say to seem like a good candidate? Hmm. Think something up yourself. That way you can be yourself. Wait, come back! The interview is soon! You're not just gonna leave me here like this, are you? Well, what a joke. Come on! And I'm here trying to take this seriously. Okay, then moving on. There's probably gonna be a test on my skills in the interview, right? I'm confident in my circus skills, which, but which skills should I show them? For a circus, it's gotta be acrobatics. Ah, that's it. For a circus job, obviously the best choice is some study mid acrobatics. But the interview is gonna be in Eden, right? Who's gonna set up all the acrobatic equipment? You? You can't do it, can you? Oh, is that the is that time already? I need to get started on my way to the interview. Okay, here's the agreed upon payment then. I got three based meat. I'm still a little nervous, but interview. Here I come! I don't need a chaperone. Introducing me for the job was enough. It won't make me look good if I have someone accompany me to the interview. If I ever get the chance to get the big stage, I'll make sure to get you a ticket. You'll definitely have to come then. Okay, right then. I hope I gave him the right answers. Because I just wanted to tell him, be yourself. Just being truthful and honest directly to the face of the man would be everything you need. Oh, a triple to this poor Digimon. Goodbye. And these bloody blooders are vaccine. They must be annihilated. Buy vaccine. It's just so brutal. Atomic blaster. Cruel, I know, but they must die for being in my way. And I got a pearl. How would a digital pearl work? You know, I just realized, thanks to Mire, the lab, the Digilab person, I technically could be the biggest fraudster in the world by bringing digital items into the real world and selling them to real people. Here's this digital pearl. I will take it out of the digital world and make it a real thing. I create mass. Get comboed, kid. And Impmon can just die. Goodbye, Impmon. 
if we want, we can create another Gilmon. We shall log out and go grab that other one, and then at some point, check and see if the interview went well. But there's a thing over here. Take a break. I'm gonna save and take a break. See what happens, because I didn't realize that was an option. What? Well, let's just keep going forward for now. I was what? I heard there are lots of TC members about. Who cares? You're not real. What is this? What is this weirdness? I'm very confused by this. What is this place? How did I get here just by falling asleep? Oh no, double Ogremon all the way. Luckily, they are super easy to kill, apparently. Get Destruction Cannon too. At least you should be... Yeah, you should be decent experience. I just want to know what the hell this is. It's just like, hey, take a break. And I took a break, and now that I... Uh, was this something I probably should have left off to later? Growlmon, you must annihilate your friend. Yourself. I say as I... Ah, well, you can then now go to annihilate him. Die. <laughs> Who are you? I'm you, but stronger. Is, uh, I have no idea where this is going. I have no idea what this is. Uh, this is something that I'm fairly certain you can easily miss because it's just a random button press in the office that you can easily miss because you're walking towards the board. I'm just very interested in this. I'll destruction cannon this one, get him out of here. And then we can just beat this one up normally. No SP needed. Nine experience away from leveling up, my boy. Hmm, that's the way out, but I want to go up the long way. See what the long way has to say. Because obviously there's got to be like an item up there. What if it's a memory up? I could never forgive myself if I missed that memory up. Nope, just another strength chip. Which I should probably use in boss battles. It would just probably be a good idea. Full destruction cannon you, just get you out. And I trust that you'll be able to annihilate him. You're a failure. Luckily so is he. Give him some knuckle sandwich. but surely they level up to incredible power. And it probably will be a better idea to let my ultimate levels like level up to max and keep them that way. At most, 
like level digivolving them one by one maybe because I don't fully want to risk leveling up my Digimon a grand degree again because it would be relatively easy to level up the Digimon to like probably the 20s and 30s but then they'll slowly get harder and harder to digi like uh, level up as time goes on if I digivolve them. We're already having kind of trouble leveling up my ultimates as it is. Wait, no, that's the wrong way. That's the way to the already gotten dead end item. I can't wait for Digimon Survive. Digimon Survive, it's only a few days away, I assume. I assume they haven't changed anything. Dear God, I hope. But I can't tell, because they haven't launched the diggity damn Steam page yet. Agony. All I want is a Steam page. All I want is a Steam page, Bandai Namco. Well, let's see where this goes. What on? Hey, sorry I'm late. But look, look, I brought food just like you asked. Fuka, hurry up, hurry up! Hey, wait your turn. Lecky, you'll get yours soon enough, all right? Come here, Nunu. Your food is always so tasty, Fuka. Jeez, you two are always such pigs. I want to play Fuka... Oh, Lucky. I want to play Fuka once we're done eating. Yeah, let's play. Hey, wait, I want to play. <coughs> Nunu, you don't have to rush. Take it slow. Has this been a thing I could have done all this time? Got memory bits? Was that a dream? You're awake. We got a new case to solve. Stop sunbathing like a cat and check the board. Okay, so I'm going to assume that's something that we can't do. Oh, great. More cases have... Another case has been added. Knight of the Enigma. Help my sister. Hmm. Dimmy... Uh, place uncertain. Jumpy hacker. Dimmy Devamon. Dimmy Devamon. I can't find my Dimmy Devamon. It just must be somewhere in the real world. Help me look. Sure, my dude. Place uncertain. Do you know where it is? You're awake. We got a new case to solve. Stop sunbathing like a cat. Somewhere in the real world. Well, guess it's off to wandering around some... Oh, hey. Om Omnimon D Digivolve. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Nokia, take me. Take me. Yes, yes, fine. If I take you, will you calm down? Ah, Neon. All right, then. You might as well hang out with Neon. I will file the case at the office. Thanks. Huh? You're asking if we combine together? Could we become o Omnimon? Yeah, we would. But we would stick out if we were walking around as Omnimon. Yeah, so we decide I should. Uh, we should keep this form whenever walking around the human world with Nokia as much as possible. Also, when we combine together, we expend more of our power. Yeah, we have to conserve our power. That way, when we need it, we could use it to protect Nokia. Aw, uh, you guys. We can combine and turn to Omnimon whenever we want to. So don't be afraid, Nokia. Neon. Ah, shucks. That's not how the game works. At all. At least not my Digimon. You can go to Uno now. Okay. Oh, hey, it's a Ganamon. Yeah, I'm, I'm sleepy. I think it's about time for my fourth nap of the day. Adorable. The museums, they're straight down here. Let me be the first to tell you, though, you don't want any part of that right now. I told that couple, I told them, it's way too dangerous for their little sightseeing tour. Hey, no skin off my nose if something happens to them. There used to be a temple here, but the war took, the, took it. The spirits that once resided there were reborn as this park. 
you're so smart, sweetie. Even the scholars of you know have nothing on you. And what's with you, good goblin? Get out of here! This hole belongs to me now! I don't believe you. Will you fight me? Nope. But definitely interesting. Goodness gracious, what's going on? Oh, you want to fight? You must want to fight because you're giving me that I want to fight glare. And then he didn't fight me because he was a coward. I don't have any reason to go past here, but there are museums. But yeah, what was that weird memory thing? But okay, I can go to Yuno now. Well, off to Shinjuku, I guess. Luckily, we already walked around a lot, so we just need to look for a Demi Devimon. That'll probably have been added to the map. And the police are still in a standoff. Can I talk to the Numamon? I cannot talk to the Numamon. Nope, doesn't seem to be any Devimon, Demi Devimons over here. I wish I could quick travel. Like if I could just press a button, bring up a menu, and go to the various places. Like not even subsections, just take me to the entrance of an area from anywhere within an area. Hmm, that Sunamon guy disappeared. And that, uh, Niaramon. Hope they're not being obliterated. Still no Etamon. Akihabara. Yeah, there's nothing. No way, no way. I wish I could give that Gazimon a loan of money. Oh, hey, Demi Devamon. Who are you? My master told all of you to come bring me back? What is this? Where I'm going is none of your business. If you don't back off, you'll have to face me. Yeah, that sounds like a Demi Devamon. Venom trap. You utter fool. Get kicked. You're getting triple comboed, my dude. It's like he just spits venom at the Where Guru Mon, and my team just like, fine, annihilate this bastard. Oh, he has health. Aw, he has health. Sadness. I wanted him to be annihilated. But for some reason, he just has a lot of health. Why do you have so much health? I get it, you're a boss, but still. But boss. Lol, you healed. The most minor of health. Die. Well, kick him with a rock. Did the anti-panic really just get panicked? Seriously, you're just a Demi Devimon. We'll go ahead and anti-panic you. It's just immensely amusing when these lower level... Bastard. Luckily you missed. Why? Because you're a bastard. Get triple comboed again, little man. Screw it. Atomic Blaster. Deal damage. Kill him. Kill him. 
You have big feet and you're ugly. Let's see. You can walk in Napalm 2 at least. Quit trying to panic my Digimon. Ah, screw it. We'll just damage you out. Slowly but surely. Poison everyone you want. Won't help you. We're just gonna punch you out of the air like the beach ball that you are. Get out of here. That better give decent experience for the health we grinded through. Nope, he's a... Yeah. You guys are good. I told you Digimon, they're lucky to have a master that takes care of them. My master's hardly been eating at all recently. I'm always left there, waiting alone. Right then, Digimon can... Right then, Digimon can now travel to the human world, so I will get out of here and find my master. You were the one who came for me in the end. My master doesn't care about me at all. Your master is looking for you, too. Huh? Does my master ever get sad when I'm not around? Okay, time to stop wallowing. Time to get home to master. When I see my master, I'll tell him how I really feel. I'll tell him I'm lonely, you idiot. I'm gonna try and go to my master. It's okay. I think I know where he is. Thanks. So, he just needed a little bit of venting to be done. But do you have any siblings? No abomination, I have no siblings. Even if I had, I would not introduce them to you. You horrifying abomination. Sleuth rank up! Skilled cyber sleuth. And a new case has been added. Oh yeah, Shinjuku Fu Tour. <laughs> Another memory up. Agumon and the others just want to eat and eat. Take them to Shinjuku and feed them. We'll settle up later. Sure. Because Night of the Enigma. That was... Hmm. I hope this doesn't, like, advance the story. It shouldn't. You know should be the one. Yay, Neon! Thanks for taking the case. This kid really wants to eat something delicious from the real world. We want to learn more about humans through food. I'm hungry, I'm hungry! So, what do you say, Neon? Wanna hang out? We're... I'm hungry, I'm hungry! Where are you gonna take us? Mm, well, hey, Neon, where would this, do you think? Maybe some Italian food? Uh, what? Are you crazy? We're not going on a date, you know. We should go somewhere for real food, don't you think? Also, you have to consider the cost of an Italian place. Yeah, that's right. I think I remember uh, looking for a family restaurant in Shinjuku before. It's casual, it's cheap. Did I mention it's cheap? Lol. Neon, we're doing the why are you asking me face. <laughs> Whichever, it doesn't matter. Let's just eat. I'm starving. Okay, let's go to a family restaurant in Shinjuku. Are we going to face Digimon discrimination? I think we're going to face Digimon discrimination. The world is going to heck. And here's Nokia be like, take my Digimon out for food. Huh? That sweet smell. Where's it coming from? Oh, it smells so good. Huh? <laughs> Yuku? Lol. Oh, what are you doing here, Nokia? Oh, that was Agumon. Huh? Oh, nothing really. Nokia, this place is such a huge menu. What would you like? Mm, let me see. How about the hamburger? Hamburger? Everyone in the human world eats it. It's cheap, delicious, popular, and basic. Also, this looks delicious, but what's steak? That's... Everyone likes it, but it's not a common food. It's expensive and high class. Really? Okay, then I'll have it. Lol. Get owned, Nokia. I think I'll try the Chateaubriand steak. What? Why are you such expensive dishes in a place like this? Neon, what do you have? Rice of hashed meat and shrimp pelle. Pilaf, 
Well, this looks like good basic family menu restaurant. It looks so good, it's hard to choose. Oh, what's this? Rice omelet. It's simple, so it's a good test for the chef's skills. Okay, let's give it a try. Sorry for the wait. Here's your rice omelet. Wow, so this is it. Okay, so the egg is well done, not soft in the middle like a lot of places these days. It's done like you'd expect from a family restaurant. The firmness of the egg is perfect for a traditional rice omelet. Well, let's see what else, what is, uh, blah, blah, blah. oh, this is delicious. I think the taste of the ketchup base and the chicken rice might be uh, too strong. The flavor of the egg complements the flavor of the chicken rice beautifully. Huh, no Digimon discrimination. That was delicious. I'm completely stuffed and I'm nearly broke too. Broke? Ah, uh, yeah, never mind. So have you learned about how we eat in the human world? Yeah, but not nearly enough. I want to eat more. I need more. Come on, Nokia, please do it for the Digimon Human Relations. I, uh, uh, well, what about a pork cutlet place? You get a decent portion size that's reasonably cheap. Why did it show? Uh, well, let's check the case file. See where it takes us. Pork cutlet shop. I could still go for another full meal. I need more food. More food. Let's get more food. Yay. Let's see who can eat the most. But, but you guys, could you try to hold back a little, please? I'm going to have pork blade, a pork loin, cutlet, and fried prawns, and what do you want, Nokia? I, um, I... Yeah, what would you suggest? I don't get a say. I'm but a digital creation of this game. You can't go wrong in a pork cutlet place. The best choice would be the pork loin cutlet. A light tender pork filet would be good too. Whenever I go to eat at a pork cutlet place, I want a nice loin cutlet with oil drizzled on top to bite into. Here you are, your loin cutlet. Wow, this is its quite well done. It's cooked to a light brown, but it still stimulates the, the appetite. Okay, I'm gonna put a bit more sauce on the pork cutlet. I know lots of people say the right way to eat it is put the sauce in a separate dish in order to keep it crunchy, but I prefer it this way because the sauce seeps into the batter and I like how that changes the taste. Oh, this is delicious. Loin cutlet is definitely the best. The flavor pouring out of the fatty portion of the cutlet is absolutely amazing. Neon, are you even listening to me? I'm doing my food reviewer. You are off in your own world again. Can you give me a hand? It's a bit of an emergency. Neon, how much money do you have? I, I don't seem to have enough. I have lots of money. In that case, should we just dine and dash? I'm going to have to pay it off by working for him. Work it off? You don't have any money, Nokia? Well, I am. Um, it's not. It's just that, um. Do you have it or not? Which is it? Let me give her the money. I have the money. Aw, oh, hungry. Yeah! What? What? Agumon, are you having a tantrum? Okay, they're both going insane. Alright, that's very bad. What happened? Do I have to beat him up? Hello, Yuko. Uh, Yuko, what are you doing here? Leave this to me. I'll pay. Don't worry about it. Please, eat all you want. I'll join. You'll join us? It's an awful thing to miss a meal. I'd like to make sure they aren't going hungry. Um, okay, I don't really see why, but I guess it's fine with me. Thanks, Yuko. So, Agumon and Gabumon just acted like brats? Lol. That's fine. Don't mention it. There's nothing worse in the world than being hungry. Still, you can't really pack it away. You still can't really pack it away, Yoko. Th that's not true. Huh? But you kept ordering more cabbage and miso soup. Nokia, stop it. You're embarrassing me. I am stop sorry. All right, then. Let's go home. Ah, uh, really? I want to eat. I want to eat. I need more food. You guys have had enough for one day. Would you like some dessert? Huh? No, Yoko! There's a desert place I'd like to go, I'd go around to. Would you guys like to come along? Friggin' hilarious. Alright, let's see if we can find the, 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 the dessert place. I assume it'll be a, around here. No, that's not the that dessert place. It's a... What is it? A gotcha machine. Are you gonna tell me where the dessert place is? Candy shop. I'll try the other side. Because she said it's around here. I mean, is this the candy shop? Nope. Where is the candy shop? 
<laughs> Wait, what is that? Neon, the dessert place is calling you. You should go there. You can see it from the crossing. I can, but I can't do the crossing. And this isn't it. Unless this guy is blocking it. You can see it from the crossing, but I cannot activate it. No, that's a sports shop. No, that's a dress shop. Again. Come on, where's the dessert place? You said I could see it from the crossing, but I can't. Is it over here? Ah, here it is. I know you just finished a big meal, but you'll have one more once you're standing in front of a dessert place. I always have room for dessert. Room for dessert? Room for dessert means the god gave us humans a separate room in our stomachs to use and it really counts for dessert. I don't believe in that. A separate room? Never mind about all that. What do you guys want to eat? Those jelly-filled wafers look good. I want one of those sweet dessert salads. Could I have the Shiratama dumplings, Mitsumamami Shiroku soup, Zinze soup, and Tokorodan? Huh? You, are you crazy? No need to worry. I have enough to pay the bill. Ah, uh, no, that's not what I mean. By the way, would you like neon? <laughs> that was delicious! Wow, I'm stuffed! I'm full now. How was that? Did you learn about he uh, human eating customs? Yeah, thanks everyone! I wonder what the restaurant people thought about having Digimon come to their places. Still, you can seriously pack it away, Yuko. But that's not true. But thanks to you guys, I've been able to learn about gourmet food. Really? I don't like eating out alone when people might be watching me. I see, girls are always obsessing over that kind of thing. I don't, but... Actually, I want to go out, uh, get to know more restaurants. As a matter of fact, I sent a case to your office. Huh? You sent a case? I rank gourmet restaurants as a... I knew it! I knew it was you! I am a master detective of reasoning. Uh, so I asked for a secret food critique. Oh, that was you! Uh, wait, wait a sec. Why'd you what? Why'd you scream? Why'd you scream, Nokia? Quiz time. Frogs are amphibians. Monkeys are mammals. What are bats? Mammals, I think. And I got a memory up for that. That hilarious kind of side thingy. And uh, hmm. A villainous cinematic case. Sakuyamon, Broadway through Floor 3. Another billionaire USB. A client is being uh, punished for taking movie roles. Please stop this before things get real bad. And then up here is the You Know Help My Sister. Which feels like it's... Because what is this? We don't... The purple ones are... We haven't had a purple one since like the tutorial. We'll take this. Broadway 4-3! And we can't do a rest. Well, we'll just take the ele uh, escalator. I almost said elevator. Interior crocodile alligator. Also, we can connection jump into this. Sure. Nobody questions it. Ah, great timing. Some Digimon friends of mine were summoned by this letter. Here it is. To all villainous looking Digimon, want to star as a villain in a squadron hero movie I'm making? Isn't this a great invitation you don't deserve? This is a great chance to make use of your villainousness. See you soon. You're truly all, all of us in the Knights of Justice. Isn't that just terrible? I mean, I guess they look a little villainy, but this is just way too cr rude, right? These guys calling themselves the Knights of Justice just contacted my friends and summoned them to a place somewhere inside this dungeon. I'd like you to stop them before they do something stupid. I'll follow afterwards, but could you go ahead and check the situation out? All right, interesting. And I mean, <laughs> you're very interesting. Got HP, like a HP thingamajig. I wonder if we'll run into any Digimon, or if we'll hi I wonder if we'll have to fight the Digimon friends. 
Ooh, we're gonna have to do a crack to get that item. Oh no, we have to fight Gatomons. They do tons of damage. Oh, and the, well, that's not good. I forgot we didn't level up and put things back in order. But luckily you are very weak. So I don't even have to worry about it too much. Goodbye, Gatomons. At least Growlmon leveled up. Home gate. Wall crack four. Boost banana. And I guess while it's on the mind, let's go ahead and restore some SP to the others. And I guess a little bit of healing for where Gururumon. Because he did get battered by the poison. Oh, am I a, a Myotismon? A Lilithmon? And a, a dark, uh, I forget your name, Ward Greymon. Seriously, how long are they going to keep us waiting? They're the ones who called us here, and now they make us wait? It's so insulting. I'm going to make them sorry for this. They'll regret it. Huh? Oh, they're gonna assume I'm the one. Hey, what are you doing? Took you long enough? Don't play dumb. You're the one who called us here. Did you really think you'd get us to help with such a rude letter? Sorry, we're not impressed. Is that how you ask someone for something? You will pay dearly for this. Oh, I don't even get a Dark War Greymon points. He bitch slapped War Greymon. Take out Rosemon. Oh, that's not going to be good. Hmm. I'll take out my Otismon. He seems to. He'll probably be weaker. Well, it depends. Never mind, we'll probably go after... Yeah, well, Atomic Blaster you, just to get one out as quickly as possible. I beg of you to not do the... Okay, good. He didn't do... Well, that's not good. Please don't kill Black War Greymon, Garurumon. Heal up. Try and take down Black War Greymon. Okay, and probably we should go after Bibbidi Bop. Final Aura. That's not nice. All right, that's a busted move. Jerk. Night Raid. Okay. Good. Good. You went after the worst one. All right, we're going to have to target you down then. Atomic Blast. Yeah, target down Rosemon. Doesn't matter if it's weaker. We need to get you out. Don't you dare final aura again. Well, we're probably gonna have to revive capsule where Garurumon. Why is it a full heal? I hate that. Just gonna use a spray. Because there's no point, like, unless the trick is to, like, I don't even know. Let's 
try you. Again, have to do this because this game is mean. Best luck in this fight. I can already tell this is kind of a super tricksy fight. Hmm. I want to target you down, but if you get low health, we'll probably keep doing final aura. So I'll try and target down my Otismon. See how that works. Please don't kill Cyberdramon. I'd hate to... I have lots of heals. But it's still quite a bother. Another meteor fall. Not terrible. And you know what? We're just going to do an SP spray if we have it. You are a very annoying bitch. Like it would change anything. Hmm. I guess we shall continue focusing you down then. Try to get you out on a lucky hit or something. It would have been nice if the game prepared me a bit more for this by actually utilizing the purples. But this is the first purple. I should have seen the, known that this would have been weird by the purple. I just didn't think on it. All that much. I don't have that many status effects. And I don't know if... Like, the AI actually function under... The Bobby ba Oh, hey, we might actually be able to annihilate you. Hopefully. But... War Growlmon is going to be... Yep, immobilized. Please don't file on a final aura. Thank you. Get her out. Get her out. Don't even get her a chance. Okay. I'll have to revive you. Alright, we're going to go ahead and do a revive. Hmm. Since they're both actually. I could change out War Growlmon, put Angelomon in. And Angelomon should have revived. So, yep, Angelomon, come on in. This will be the perfect time for you. Alright, we'll get rid of the bastard. The bastard man. Alright, revive the dear Wegururuman. Actually make use of that. Wait, let's see. Undo's base stat boosts on target. In that case. Then maybe, do we have anything? No, this will probably be the best that we have for this. What if we should do another spray? We'll do another B spray. Just to be safe. So we'll target down my Otismon. 
I would say. Since he seems weak. Weaker. Quit targeting the poor where Garuruman. And Jesus Christ, Edgewoman. Let's see. Should probably. I find it hilarious that I have more A's than B's. But this will probably heal you full, so have it. And in that case, honestly, it might be a good idea to use another spray, but I don't want to waste it too much. So we'll... Honestly, where Garurumon isn't going to be that important ability-wise, so we're going to let him just be kind of like a, a, beat, a beat stick, in a way. He'll just be beaten up by the enemy. You can punch him. You don't really need to use your abilities that much. They don't do much. But let's see. Holy Light 2. Of course! Because the game hates me! The game just wants me to suffer. I only get misses in actual battles where it matters. Oh, of course you're doing this now. Where Garuruman's gonna get annihilated. Never mind. Okay. Punch my Otis Mod. And we're gonna go ahead and do Aura just to heal us up a bit. Ooh, a heal combo. Haven't had this before. Probably because I don't use them that much. Get rid of my Otis Mod. How dare you live? Hey, where Garurumon? You can punch him. Punch him out. This really is like the anime, except you won. All right. I guess Celestial Aerial. Beat him up. I am just happy that Rosemon only did so many final auras. Oh, hey, we got a crit, lol. Punch his lights out. 39. Good for you. Be gone. Well, time for a, uh, another Celestial Arrow. Because it's your most powerful attack, it does so much damage for some reason. Dark Terra Force? Huh. It would have been cool to see another Dark Terra Force. It probably wouldn't have done much, but it would have been cool. I'm just going to normal attack you. Because I don't think it's that important. Yeah, like that. Bye-bye. <laughs> I only got through with only one... Knockout, and I was able to use the revive ability that I never used this entire game up until now. Huzzah! I won. You haven't beaten me yet! I'm not gonna let you make fun of me like that! That's right, I'm still standing, I demand a proper apology! We're gonna make you pay for pissing us off! What? You didn't send it? What's this about then? Explain. What? You were sent here by Sakuya Mom to stop us. So then you weren't the one who sent the letter? I see. We misunderstood. Sorry for lashing out at you like that. You must have heard it from Sakuya Mom. To make fun of someone you don't even know kind of pisses us me off. We may look like villains, but even people who look like villains have feelings. It's not very nice to talk to us like that. Anyway, these Knights of Justice still haven't arrived. Haha, <laughs> sorry for the wi- Jimmykin! <laughs> Huzzah! We cut through evil light, we've sliced through evil in a single stroke. In the depths of night we shine bright, a star in the hearts of all. Oh, I thought you would have been Jimmykin because of the use of lol. I just have, like, PTSD when it comes to that. Because whenever I hear, nobody else has used LOL or LAMAL. Well, then again, he didn't only really use LOL. He used 
lulls. But still, I just have, like, PTSD. Jimmikin uses that. Starmon! Knight of Justice! Huzzah! Evil weeps when we appear. Evil runs when we are near. Whenever we hear their cry, we'll cross the earth, we'll cross the sky! I probably should have realized it would have been these guys. More Super Starmon! Knight of Justice! Huzzah! The heavens, the earth, and ev even evil knows. We are the justice incarnate. We'll burn evil from the word with the light of justice. We are fate itself! Okay, he is cool looking. Just I'm on! Knight of Justice! We oppose evil in all its forms. We dedicate ourselves to eradicating it. That which shines within our hearts is a burning love for justice! Uh, then why... Okay, they made a specific animation for that. But why did they use lol? Why did they use lol? Only Jimmikin is allowed to be that stupid. Are you insane? So let me get this straight. You guys called us here just to tell us about all this justice crap? S yeah, so sorry for the wait. Prepare yourselves, villains! Why should we prepare? You say all this awful stuff to us and then you have the gall to talk about justice? A very existence is just in itself. You guys are the bad guys. Huh? Are you an ally of these villains? Fine, we'll stop by dealing with you. I have to fight two groups. I have to fight two groups, oh no. At least I get to make my team and save. All right. Uh-huh. I'm gonna go to my field guide and see if I can... Because I know I have at least one Starmon. Or at least have had, so I'll be able to, like, look at his type. Starmon, he is a base, so we want Virus. Just, um, I doubt the other ones will be... So we'll probably want Base and Virus as our team. I can only assume. Organize. So, by Cyberdramon, we'll have Lilith, uh, Piximon, and Growlmon come in. I think that will... And first, let's also t check their abilities. Uh, mirror Reflection, I don't really do... Exheal for one Digimon. I will put that on. Why not? Anyone? Shame Plus, I don't really use it. Saint Knuckle might be nice, I guess. Where Garurumon, Speed Charge, I hardly use that. There is Mock Rush, but I don't think it would help. So yeah, I think that'll do. We will save, and we'll beat up the Justice people, I suppose. Looks like they've chosen you. You already beat us, so you'll beat them, no problem. Ha! We remember... We members of the Justamon Squadron don't know the meaning of the word defeat. We challenge you to a fight! Ah, uh, what's wrong? You afraid of our m m boss Justamon? Why do you get such uniqueness? Justamon Squadron! Move out! Did you flashbang me? Of course you get to go first. Yeah, meteor shower. Should have seen. I can't wait to actually see your, like, ah, uh, crap. Uh, okay. So this is probably the best layout because two of them are base that my virus types can take care of. Piximon, on the other hand, will take care of Justamon. Atomic Blaster! Please don't kill my pixie. Okay, good. He didn't go for my pixie. But please don't kill my Wereguru Ramon. Hmm. I should probably heal just to be on the safe side. Because Growl. War Growlmon's gonna be immobilized from the Bibbidi Bop. Another pit bomb for you. Immobilized. Another star uppercut. No attack field. Which, honestly, is good, because it's a little bit of a waste of a move. Good, thank you. Die. 
and acceleration boost. They're very focused on buffs to really be that much of a threat. Pip bomb to your face. And I'm just gonna annihilate you. Get out. Please don't hit the Pixie Mom. Thank God. It didn't kill. Mm, I will heal just to be safe. Uh, let's see. We'll full heal because I have more of those. Meteor Shower! All right, pit bomb to Justamon. Kick your face. You are honestly easier than the last guys, probably because you're doing too many buffs. Way too many buffs and, uh, I don't know, you're just not doing as much damage as the villainous team did. You are kind of whimsy. Whimsy, flimsy. It'll be hilarious if Justamon dies first. Piximon is badass. And for some reason, he keeps going after Piximon. Atomic Blaster. And kick to the face. Huzzah. Yeah, you are so much weaker than the villains you were going to fight. They would have... Mm, yeah, they probably would have kicked your ass. They probably would have kicked your ass. Bye-bye, Justamon. I think this kills. Lol. You know, your boss kind of sucks. And immobilized by Atomic Blaster. That's not going to help you. You are going to die to an Atomic Blaster if you survive this. You almost- you're gonna die to Piximon. Okay, you didn't. Good for you. You're gonna die to this, though. You don't even get an Atomic Blaster. Hilarious. And levels up for pretty much everyone. Huzzah. I don't believe it! We, we lost to the villains! Go apologize to them. We got a bit carried away there. Yeah, that's for sure. Hey, we demand an apology! Did you think we'd be okay if you calling us all villains? We're really not happy about what you said, nor the way you made fun of us. Don't just judge us by how we look. You seriously pissed us off. They love using that phrase, pissed, of, pissed us off, specifically. Sorry about that. Looks like we got a bit carried away. That's it, then. This stupid game is over. It's not a game. I swear we were just trying to make a cool action hero movie. Go on. Well, I have always been drawn in by the heroes in old films. I wanted to look cool on the big screen like they that too. So I got together with these guys, all of whom feel the same way, to make a masterpiece screenplay, but... Then we thought, now we just need to scout out a villain! And sort of got caught up in it. We didn't really think about your feelings. For that, we are deeply sorry. <laughs> all the dot dot dots. You could have just uh, said, hey, we're looking for... Really, all you had to do was like, hey, we want to make a movie, and you have the perfect look for a villain. Would you please come in and play an important role in our film? What are we going to do now? We can't just give up on making our movie! We'll try asking other Digimon. Hey, I know! How about we get some villain costumes and play the villain parts ourselves? It'll look pretty cheap, but I suppose if there's nothing else we can do... All right, then. We'll see you all later. Wait, can we have a look at that script? Huh? I'm interested in being your movie, I mean. Well, you explained yourself and apologized. I suppose I'm okay with helping out a bit. But you have to make sure the villains look good on screen. Uh, really? 
You guys are okay with it? Let us get started before we change our minds. Just come on, if we're gonna do this, let's do it right. Thank you so much. It seems you've managed to work things out. Sorry, when I got here, it didn't look like there was anything I could do, so I just watched from afar. But Black Gra War Greymon and his lot changed their minds and are cooperating with the Justamon guys to make a movie now, it seems. It's all been settled amicably, thanks to you. Thank you for making our dream of making a movie come true. <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> Looks like fun, with everyone pulling their talents, I'm sure this will be a great movie. We need to practice action movie stunts if we want to get a lot of fans. We have to make sure the villains' performances are perfect. We're gonna be super busy from now on. We've got a lot to make sure to get over the script carefully. Okay, I'll play the main bad guy at the end. I'll start trying out different villainous facial expressions. Hey, how about if both the good guys and the bad guys each have a song? They'll both be cool. I'll make them, uh, and show you. Awesome! We just doubled our cast. Things are looking up. Okay, let's have a prep session now. If anyone has any good ideas, feel free to speak up. Hilarious. At first, I thought they were actually luring, like, evil Digimon to fight, but no, they were just super into their roles. And then I beat them up. <laughs> and they were easier to beat. Well, I guess it makes sense, because aren't... No? I don't know. I don't know Rosemon's... I think Rosemon is ultimate. Black War Greymon's probably ultimate. Well, hilarious. Again, this feels like it would be, like, parts of a, like, a show. But hilarious. Okay, just want to make sure that another... Well, I guess it makes sense. And, uh, I think that will be it for now, since we've been going for longer. And I didn't expect to be, like, thrown into side questing again. But, yeah, I love this game. This game is a lot of fun. Let's go to the main menu so we can have a nice soundtrack. But yeah, this game is a lot of fun. It's very silly at times. Again, we're we're helping Digimon make a movie when the world is being thrown into chaos. It's hilarious. Our friend is on the run as a wanted hacker. We went dining with Digimon. It's not it doesn't make a lot of sense, but it's a lot of fun. And I didn't notice that much bad grammar from the translation this time, which is very nice. Because the last few times, the translation kind of hit my berserk button. But this time, it was relatively good. And mostly just my fault for being, like, weirded out by the flow of things. But yeah, having Digimon in the real world is super cool, even if it's from a nefarious Crusader Mon. I also find it hilarious that the Royal Knights that I can use are basically chibi. I just find that amusing. But yeah, Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth is pretty good. Hope maybe next time will be the end. I don't know. We're getting weird dream memory things with an Alekmon and a Numamon and a girl called Fuka. So I don't know. Uh, we'll find out next time. But yes, thank you very much for watching. If you want more from me, I have a YouTube channel where these streams end up. So if you want to catch up on... Well, I guess not the Digimon Adventure because I haven't actually started it uploading. Scheduling is weird there. But right now, I think Mass Effect 3 is fully uploaded. So yeah, you can go to Neon IC Games at YouTube and watch the various other games I've streamed, like Kirby and the Forgotten Land, Undertale, and the three Ma and the Mass Effect trilogy. And soon this will start uploading, if I can get around to it. And if you're already there watching these archives, you can watch me play these games live at twitch.tv slash neonicywings. And if you want art from me, like my little avatar in the corner, I, I'm, try, I'm trying to upload more art to my Twitter, DeviantArt, Newgrounds, and Tumblr. All of them at Neon Icy Wings, except for the Tumblr, which is Icy Wings Art Corner. But yes, but yes, thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you dudes next time. Bye-bye.